Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to another Starro video. Uh, this is not someone that has taken over or hacked the account. I actually did get Kafka. I wasn't sure if I wanted to pull for her. I love the character, I love her aesthetic and like the, the role she has in the game, but I didn't really like her gameplay, so I decided to go for one pity. We got her, got lucky, love to see it. We're finally gonna do the next part of the story because even advertisements are spoiling it. <laughs> I cannot escape it, so we need to get this done ASAP. I've seen a lot of shots, I'm not sure what exactly goes goes on, but I want to I want to get the noise myself now. You can expect a Kafka building video at some point, uh, but probably when Genshin is dull, and since Fontaine is coming out in two days at the time of recording this, very unlikely that that's anytime soon, but I do want to do more Star Rail, like, more gameplay oriented content instead of just the story. But for now, I'm so far behind, and we're still catching up on the story, uh, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. Anyway, it will all be on this channel now, and uh, I hope you enjoy. Let's get into it. I'm actually gonna get some breakfast first and wake up a little bit. <laughs> be right back. Hey, all right, I switched the party around a little bit. This is a party that actually makes sense. Like, their characters are pretty well built, except for my MC, but I did want the MC in the party. It just, it feels more right. I don't know why I'm claiming this. There's absolutely no need to. I'm gonna press V and start the desolate depths of despair, pass through the artisanship commission shortcut and head to the alchemy commission. The storm calls, calms in the artisanship commission and a shortcut also opens up. You should pass through here as per the general's recommendations and head to the alchemy commission. That was our last bit of dialogue, I believe, before we did the Don Shu part, right? We were all standing there and there was a little kid <laughs> and the little kid was like, hey, I'm not a little kid. I was like, shut up, little kid. And then, yeah. Now we're here. Okay, the reason I have no skill points is because yesterday I pulled and I got Kafka and... How do I get there? I went the wrong way. Kafka and Sampokoski. And uh, <laughs> so when you use Sampokoski's E, he goes, hee hee. <laughs> so I just mashed it 10 times. I had a good time. Is this thing... I guess that's just there always? And it that got corrupted? And I thought the flower itself also spawned from the tree growing. Where is the tree? I'm not very, like, uh, my spatial awareness in this area isn't there yet. <laughs> but that's okay. Oh, here we go. I, I turned on music as well. This is a pretty area. I like this already, except for the dead people. Not as pretty. I think I said that last time. Oh my god, what the hell? There's a deer thing there, too. Uh, whoa. Looks like the battle here was intense. Okay, I mean, is there any battle that isn't really intense? The Master Diviner must have launched the campaign while we were delayed in the Artisanship Commission. Yeah. She must have divined- oh, she must have divined it was the right time. I mean, that would make sense. Can't imagine her paying orders to the word. That's toxic. Why am I so mean? Indeed. Since <laughs> he agrees to. tasked the Master Diviner with commanding the Cloud Knights, he must have known she'd act on the results of her divination. Yeah, fair enough, though. Thank goodness the general That's what you're a diviner for, no? With the knights. Fighting is totally different from adventuring. Yeah, we're great fighters, too, though. All these people it's tough to bear well we're still seeing them dead so it's not that much different i'm afraid this is nothing benefactor uh -oh. centuries ago an emanator of abundance besieged the lafu with the aim of taking the ambrosial cool arbor they destroyed half our delves and killed most of the cloud knights yeah i'm sorry uh, architectural talks <laughs> this color palette like the light gray with this darker gray slash bluish and then a bit of the red it's such a pretty color combination for long life species such events are more like yesterday's so memories weird. than ancient history this awful spectacle is child's play in comparison yeah hey is that supposed to make us feel better no we're just facing reality it's hard to tell if the master diviner won or lost here. Well, definitely took an L, but it's in the greater scheme of things. <laughs> I think it was a total victory. Seems to me her troops were wiped out. Let's play it safe. This was a draw. It's a close battle, but it's still going. Uh huh. This isn't a tournament, you know. Oh. I can't see many cloud knights. The Sienjo must have fought well. Uh huh. Not necessarily. There'd usually be a base with supporting forces set up after a successful see? engagement, but it's a draw. We don't see any of that. No, because they kept moving. They're still fighting. They're running and fighting at the same time. Let's look around and see if we can find some clues. Oh, I love when we do detective work. All right, then Sherlock. Let me check. Mm, yeah, seems pretty dead to me. 
On the monster's rigid body, several conspicuous wounds are shrinking at the speed of discernible to the, or at a speed discernible to, 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 to the naked eye. Despite the absence of any vital signs, you sense that the monster in front of you is not completely dead. Kill it. Finish it. Finish it off. Be careful. Those monsters There's are pretty tough. There's a man. Tough. I'm okay. I'm inspecting people. But we should kill that thing. All right, inspect the wolf for sure. Come on. <laughs> Come on. They had a little tea time together. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. Collect. Travelogue on the Sienjo. Hello. Oh. Whew. Such reach. I see a chest. That I'm not yet gonna grab, I know. It pisses people off, but... Hey! Oh, no way! Are you the healer from... The... Plains? Here. There are still survivors here. It's, uh... Mm, I also groan in real life. <laughs> You're not the knights. No. What is your purpose here? Healing. It's dangerous. I love this. Woman in healer dressing. We're reinforcements. Healer dressing. I want There's some healer dressing. Everyone else. <laughs> Resorting to short life species as reinforcements. Wow. <laughs> Jing Yuan is truly running out of options. You're actually being racist. <laughs> Run! She's a disciple of Satis Medicus. I believe it, because I thought it was Don Chu. Silence. If my healing worked, you'll become one of us. Oh, she said one of us. Kill her! <laughs> it's not just me they'll be running from. Kill her! Oh, nice. We do get the killer. So, is she just gonna stand? Hurry! Leave here! Okay. I will. I can't oh, this is the night. Okay. Bonk. Absolutely smackadoodled. Bonk. It's fine. Bang. You are gone. All oh, right, you heal. Forgot about that. Forgot about that detail. What if I just press this? Haha, <laughs> that's right. Punch me. Okay, so this arc does keep going. We decided to spare Don Shu, and now we either get punished for it or rewarded in the long run, but... And what are these, then? What are those? Why seek death? Why, you kind of attacked me. I'm not really looking for it. You kind of just started punching me. <laughs> Their pictures here are so stupid. I'm sorry, but... They look so derpy. Ooh. <laughs> Huge. There's more. Yes, I actually want to join you guys. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus can provide all that you desire. <laughs> I did the trials. I wrote the thing a hundred, hundred thousand times or whatever. And you still haven't let me in. You're fake. Oh, the rallying howl. Oh, God. Don't let him howl again. Boonk. <laughs> I love that move. Fire MC is actually really good, but I just don't have the gear. Because all my defense gear went on Gep. For cannon, th <clears throat> this makes more sense, and the fights are actually kind of tense, which is cool. I like it, but I could smack these guys up if I went to real team. Stop. Did you just call a friend that has one health? This isn't... This, what is the thing called? Who wants to be a millionaire? Call a friend. Go center. Boom. Oh, triple crit. We looking kind of fancy here. Nah, that's... No. Ow, I have three health. That was some... Baloney that you targeted her. All right, we good? Cutscene? Hold on, we'll find someone to help. I don't think you can. Don't waste your time. They've converted me. I'm sorry. I don't have much longer. What do you want me to tell your wife and kids? Go. The master diviner's troops are ahead. Sir, he stops talking. It could be because he is exhausted, or he's waiting for you to leave him be. Let's go. Sir. What are your last words? Okay, I will convey that to your wife. <laughs> the disciples of Sanctus Medicus were in hiding for so long. Mm -hmm. Now they finally show their face. Mm -hmm. Did the Master Diviner fail to foresee this? Oh, that's a scary thought. Be careful, benefactors. The disciples of Sanctus oh, Medicus worship Yaoshi, the plague's author. Yaosha. The greatest enemy of the Sienjo. I love how they pronounce that so much. The Alliance has been trying to root out their secret organization for millennia. Really? It's no coincidence that they've chosen this moment to reveal themselves. Wow. I must have been in Kafka's script or Elio's script. 
The army is covered in sword marks, but the strange thing is that these marks all came from the deceased's own weapon. Crazy. Um, the frog has no history. <laughs> this looks kind of wild. Look at the sea. It's pretty. A bit of sun. You see the rays. I'd take a picture for a thumbnail, actually. Can I hide my character? Flip it. Look at that. Look at that. Tell me I'm not a good photograph. I won't believe you. <laughs> they both lead to the same way, but that's like a big boy enemy over there, and I kind of don't want to fight no big boy enemy right now. As long as the wolf doesn't see me, this thing probably runs after you light speed, no? <laughs> no, no, no. I got stuck on a jar, bro. I got stuck on a jar, man. Yeah, deserved. Such deserved L. Couldn't even maneuver around a jar. Die. Ah, uh, the 9k armor, whatever. The music is nice, though. I'm on guard. Hi, hi. She really needs more stats. I'm, I'm not doing her justice. I don't even think any of her skills are leveled at all. Nice teamwork. Nice teamwork. <laughs> Look, she's full health with one natty, and my nat is whack. She doesn't heal at all. Listen, I don't have much time to play Star Rail. I can't farm. I can't farm. And farming for artifacts is so hard in this game. It's so expensive. It's interesting. This is a really cool mechanic. When they call another wolf, they actually... Call them at the same health they're at, which I think is great, so that it's it's not too tedious and they don't just infinitely spawn more. I think that's a really nice. They it's really thought thought through, and I respect that. You know, I'm more stressed out than like excited for Fontaine. I'm obviously really excited, but I'm more like, oh man, it's gonna be so it's gonna be so scary, it's gonna be crazy to be back. Glimmering cores, immortal hiss and fifth Dude, you didn't even finish your. Curry in a bowl. These are spices, right? There's no, that's like the equivalent of having salt on the table. Look at them just hanging out there. What's this guy gotta say? Removing the helmet, you look straight into the face of the fallen cloud knight. An expression of agony is frozen on the face of the Sianjo man of indiscernible age. You find a cluster of mutated branches at the temples of his hair. He seems to have been subjected to purgatory like torture before his death. Jesus. <laughs> that sounds very dark. Um, hello. Painful moan amidst the ravaged battlefield draws your attention. Rainbow's blessing. Hello. You're not disciples of Sanctus Medicus. Nope. I actually I did chug a little ball they gave me, but I'm I'm fine. Rainbow, interesting. Uh, stop moving around. Let's see if there's a way to help you recover faster. Yeah, and a way out of here. Temporarily giving up. <laughs> Provides medical Jesus. attention. It'll help with your injuries. Temporarily giving up. Here, simple first aid device. They're rare, dude. Enjoy. You fumble through your bag to find medicine for his wounds and ad administer it in one drop at a time. For a moment, you are worried that medicine made for ordinary humans might not work on long life species. The Cloud Knight propped himself so he could stand. Thank you. All of you. Yeah, no problem. I feel much better now. I'm glad. Thank goodness you're here. The garrison is up ahead. This is a very Are young you knight. Now? Yes. I'll wait there for you. Okay. I feel like I should protect this knight. Praise the high morals. Yes. Yes. I don't know why I went with morals last time around. It's definitely morals. I don't got no revive food. Nope. 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 You so suck. Your aim is awful. No wonder you're losing the war. Oh, it's a wolf man. Dog. No, not the wolf man dog again. No, 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 no. no. You can't walk upstairs. I bet you can't. He can't! He can't walk upstairs! No! He's so fast! I'm gonna save someone. Yeah, that's right. Leave me alone. Loser. <laughs> Thought you stood a chance against me? Absolutely not. I love how far the spear jab goes. Okay, well, uh, more story time. Is this gonna be a safe town as a whole? Show yourselves. What do you mean, show it? We're standing right here in front of you. Wait, it's you. Yes. Quickly. Here. It's there's, dangerous outside. there's no way you didn't recognize me from my attire. You recognize us? Yeah. Are you not the general's guest? Mm hmm. The Master Diviner prophesied your arrival. Hey. We were ordered to wait for you under any circumstances. Hey. Fushun was here? Wait for us? Yes. The Master Diviner ordered us to remain stationed here and went to scout ahead. Okay. They're saying the disciples of Sanctus Medicus have returned. Mm hmm. They haven't been seen for an age. 
The troops are anxious. It's okay, guys. Deep breaths. Yoga, tree position. Oh, well, maybe not tree position. That could be PTSD inducing. Not, not that, not that. Uh, downward dog. Now nah, they have wolves as well. Man, it's hard. Maybe don't do yoga. It's good that you're here. The master diviner said the knights weren't to move out until you arrived. Uh huh. Please wait in the camp. We'll decide on our next steps once the master diviner returns. Want to guess that she's not gonna be back and we're gonna go look for her instead? That's the my plan. Cloud knights receive hey. orders not to advance. <laughs> is a bad sign. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus. Mm hmm. I've heard the name before. Really? If memory serves, they're an underground sect of the Abundance that's said to have lain dormant within the CNG. The Abundance. Plotting to overthrow the Alliance. I really like how simulated universe is, it like makes this make sense to me. Because you know what the trees do and like what their main thing is, it's kind of cool. The Stellaron has certainly caused Abundance-like abnormalities. Mm -hmm. Is that what motivated the Disciples to come out of the shadows? No. No. The knight's main force oh. remains intact. Something must have happened. Something we're not aware of. The I'm master diviner isn't here. Let's actually to camp and see what we can learn from the troops here. They popped it, didn't they? Good idea. Why don't you take a look around, benefactors? Sure. My feet need a rest. Maybe you put on like some more comfortable walking shoes. Real. Poor girls in all these anime games, they always have to walk on heels. It looks really good. It looks great, <laughs> but it must be unbearable. These are the little, uh, little things that Yukong has in her idol animations. Hello. It was so close. So close. What was your fight? Even seasoned soldiers. Soldiers of three centuries were turned into oh. twisted beings. Or nor. I was almost. Mm -hmm. Almost. It's okay, you made it. Your tank, your champion, your champion, Tingyun. What's up? Have you talked with these disciples, benefactor? Uh huh. What do you make of them? Not yet. Why huh. would they betray the Lafu? I don't understand. Well, I talked to Don Shu. That's the leader. No, is that not what she was asking? Not yet. This is a pretty place, though. I wonder if it's going to be full of life again after this story. Probably not. Who would have thought our enemies would turn out to be the disciples of Sanctus Medicus? Me. The Master Diviner must have kept it quiet to avoid alerting them. Hmm. Hmm. Smart. Hello, Elven Lady. Hello, Captain. This is different from all our previous battles. Captain, even our own comrades <laughs> may become our enemies this time. <laughs> Every Cloud Knight knows what they must do if their comrades become Mara struck. Don't forget your training. Yeah, this is so rough. But this shouldn't be happening. We're still so young. We're not old enough to be stricken with Mara yet. He's uh, he's having an early life crisis right now. There are records of such a phenomenon in the Cloud Knight's martial doctrine. Uh-huh. Those who come into contact with the Plague's author become Mara struck instantly. Yeah. I never thought the disciples of Sanctus Medicus were real. We were so close to us. He's badass. I... I don't like, know how many more of our soldiers. <laughs> She's like, I don't know anything about it, but I'm not that bothered by it. I'm just kind of shrugging it off. Oh, they got a little, oh my god, little dumplings. They're still warm. Look at that. They're smoking. That's crazy. All right, this dude just having a stroll. Citizens. This man looking rich. Sorry, I didn't want to stop the general distinguished guest, but I need to warn you there have been some dangerous sightings ahead for your own safety. Please stay here. All right, fair enough. Expected. Hey, Cloud Knights are guarding a prisoner who's murmuring to himself. I saw it. I saw myself become thunder. <laughs> become a storm. Hey, snap out of it. <laughs> we slap him in the face. <laughs> the elixir crucible. I could smell the future. How was it? Your flesh will not trap me. Uh-huh. I am the Ebon Deer. Oh. I see the leaves and branches covering the sky. Mm -hmm. I will change again. We captured a few devils from the disciples of <laughs> Sanctus Medicus. Uh huh. Some of them are already mad. And this one is the maddest. Oh my god, that's his nickname now. Maddest clown. The alchemist's eyes were unfocused, darting back and forth, as if he was looking at two diverging ends of a path. That's uh that's some hints right there. That's what they're seeing. Two diverging ends of a path. Or, I guess the starting end of a path? You never know. 
You all right? I just felt there were enemies all around me. Yeah, familiar places and worn out faces. Oh. I wanted to kill everything in my path. Uh huh. I'm sorry, bud. The reality of war. It sucks, man. Hey, it's a houseman. Hey, houseman. Now we're gonna get a command what talisman. Does it mean? We probably need to present it with a command for it to act. Greet me. <laughs> Greet me. Say hello. Fight back. <laughs> uh, I doubt it can walk out there. All right, let's talk to this one. There's a ghastly paleness in the face of this resident cloud knight, which we can't see because there's a helm on. As you approach him, he nods his head in salute. Forgive me for being brief. It's okay. Warfare is a dangerous business. There's no time for idle chat. You're idle chatting right now. I didn't ask you to. How's the situation? We took over this place a few hours ago under the Master Diviner's command. Okay. It was only afterwards that we learned our enemies were none other than the disciples of Sanctus Medicus. Right. Those who worship the plagues, Arthur. I feel like it would make sense if you kill people that revive? Everything was going as planned. The sorcerers of the disciples and the fantastic creatures they commanded were no match for us. Lovely. And after a while... Our comrades suddenly started to slaughter one another. Not lovely. They become Mara struck. Curse it. What Sanctus Medicus sorcery did they use on us? The uh, uh, zombification. The greatest fear of the Sienjo people is succumbing to our Mara struck form around others. Yeah. To do so means that we have given up on being human. True. Lost the abomination sleeping in our immortal blood. And violated the rainbow's admonishments. <gasps> what the disciples of Sanctus Medicus did are despicable acts that every Alliance resident detests. Fair. I swear to the Arbiter that I will avenge my comrades. Yeah, in the last part, I was like, they're not really in our way. And like, they just have a different thought. But it, what they're doing is not ethical. <laughs> That's for sure. I'd probably still side with the Cloud Knights. But you never know. Don Chu's brother. Or sister, I'm gonna guess brother, uh, Daniel Glove. Ca oh, you're actually a disciple. So I was right about that. Kalan is sending us to the captive. He steps aside you after you explain your identity and show him the general's you orders. You want to ask questions? Yeah. Uh, uh, fine. But Ow. I must be present the whole way through. This part needs to be recorded as testimony. Okay. <laughs> Finally, someone to talk to. These cloud knights are so serious. So boring. <laughs> <laughs> Hilarious. Um, I can just—I don't have any questions. I didn't say anything. Oh, I can't wait for you to talk to me. Bye. <laughs> About Stellaron, sure. That shining seed. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen it. <laughs> so beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> if you gaze into it, mm -hmm. <laughs> there's a voice inside that speaks to you. Wild. Do you still remember Cacolia? Yeah, I do. <laughs> <laughs> Just a silent giggle. The master said we could inject new life into the ambrosial arbor with it. <laughs> I didn't believe it at first. We tried many methods, spending multiple lifetimes of short life species. Yet the arbor showed no signs of resurrection. Uh huh. But look upon it now. <laughs> Only the power of an eon can recreate the miracle. Yes. Yes, the mighty Sanctus Medicus, the abundance. Mm -hmm. All right, about the arbor. So you witnessed it too. I was there. The Ambrosial arbor's resurrection. No FOMO. <laughs> Magnificent. Stop hehing. In the Befall era, so far in the past that even long life species cannot recall, Sanctus Medicus, the abundance, gifted the Ambrosial arbor to the Sienjo Lawfu. Yeah. With that sacred tree. Humanity realized many miracles. The fallow earth, the infinite life, berry, the altered flesh, the western soap berry. But that devilish archer ruined everything. Oh. They twisted right and wrong and erased Sanctus Medicus's achievements. But soon, soon we will return to the glory of the Befall era. So it's once the, it's just a religious war. Once more. <laughs> You've seen the fantastic creatures that fought with us. I've defeated them. They are only minor gifts of the Ambrosial Arbor. Okay. Shut it, rambling rodent. <laughs> the Cloud Knights will root all of you out soon. <laughs> nice, dude. Rambling rodent. Shut it. What did you do to these Cloud Knights? What did we do? Yeah. 
We cured our kin. <laughs> it must hurt to be trapped in such weak flesh and blood. Bro, you're... Well, why aren't you one of them, though, actually? You scum. If the order allowed, I would cut you down now. <laughs> oh, you don't understand. A short life species couldn't understand. Uh huh. Mara struck. Bah. It's bah. a second life gifted Say by hey again. Medicus to eliminate the self to achieve transcendence, mm -hmm. a life of true freedom. Yeah. I see a desire for power in your eyes. Yep. This life is too short for you, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> Ah, there he goes I again. Can, I can help you. I have a stellar on in me, dude. I'm invincible. Don't worry about Don't it. Listen, his words are poison. We're just having fun, sir. Transform me, <laughs> disciple. Without the blessing of the abundance, you short life species would never be able to endure the transformation. Transform me. All right, bye. Master Divider, you're back. Hey, let's go. Love to see you. She's so small. <laughs> I have kept you waiting. She's so small, actually. The disciples is laid bare to me now. Mm hmm You kept us waiting, all right. <laughs> Please tell us the whole truth this time. That's kind of a cool one. Apologies. To avoid dissemination of intelligence, uh -huh. the general and I kept the involvement of the disciples to ourselves. All right. I mean, you're, you, I don't know if you're going to be on the thumbnail, but... ...that seeks to overthrow the Alliance. Before the Stellaron disaster, the Disciples have remained veiled in shadow for years. Mm -hmm. Their emergence reflects their intricate connection to this calamity. Mm -hmm. The conflict is difficult, Master Diviner, but you have led your forces from the front lines and beyond in pursuit of the enemy. Admirable work. <laughs> How do you say it? I think it's like licking boots or something in Dutch, is that right? Or in French? One of the two. He's sucking up to her. Hardly. A diviner must acquire first-hand knowledge in order to calculate the future. Yeah. Collecting intelligence in this way assists me in achieving the right answer. Yeah. Wait. What's all this about a difficult conflict? Mm hmm The disciples of Sanctus Medicus have been scheming for a long time, but our army is in no way inferior. How can things be so difficult? In, in, it, it, external help. It has to be. This is a segue into us joining the fray. Just ask for our help already. <laughs> I know you don't like it, but go for it. Come on. It would seem you came prepared. Yeah, I'm aware of what you do every time. The first time we met Madame Yukong, she said something like, "Uh huh." This is a Sienjo affair. I remember that. Need for the express to get involved. Yep. And now here we are, running around doing everything. Even the IPC takes it easier <laughs> on us. Oh, let me guess. What are we up to this time? Could it be heading to the front lines? Yes. Leading the Cloud Knight charge? Definitely not that. There's no way. Well, try this on for size. Nope. <laughs> I can't stand any more of this fighting. So there. Yeah, she's actually enjoying it. <sighs> Who said you'd be heading to the battlefield? March did. <laughs> uh not? No, what are we doing? Tell us what we're doing. What is this whole game of chicken for? Jinyuan's orders. Wasting time. He said that the value of unexpected guests lies in the unexpected. Yep. The Cloud Knight's assault was to demonstrate our we power are the to be variable. head on. Now it is time for the unexpected. Yeah, that's us, dude. The variable. That's what uh Please, come with me. Sparog told us. Hey, we get to follow After her in game. Receiving the Ambrosial Arbor, the Alchemy Commission was once the Law Fu's most vital commission. Yeah. <laughs> Silence. All, it was they who changed the Sienjo natives into long life species. <laughs> they also developed many incredible technologies from the She turned around. She's like, hurry the fuck up, what are you doing? I, I kind of didn't want to skip the dialogue. The grew discontented and began to obsess over the manipulation of life. I know. Research into the arbor poisoned their minds. The more they pursued it. See, I, sh I knew I shouldn't have followed her. Morning bells chime in a dream. Evening mist gathers around me. That's cool. Do you see that? I do indeed. Whoa, I see the whole world change. What huge elixir crucibles. Oh. There's still smoke coming out of them. That's what they are. Is that where, where they brew their nasty balls? 
This is where the might be. practiced the way of immortality in ancient times. Oh. They erected elixir crucibles here to absorb the power of the arbor. I see. Turning fantasy into reality. So it was never fancy to start Since with. the smoke from the crucibles never ceases, this place was named Eve Mist Mansion. Cool. An elegant name. Yeah. But as far as the art of war is concerned, mm -hmm. it's a death trap. As long as the crucible is a threat lit and the smoke to humanity, to live, I want to sneeze. We cannot get any closer. Okay. This is why the Cloud Knights lost control and became Mora struck? Perhaps? Indeed. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus infuse the smoke that permeates this delve with medicinal pellets that elicit Mara. Bro, if I, honestly, without context, I would have just. My brain would have imploded with this sentence. Permeates this delf with medicinal pellets that elicit Mara. What? Unless the Cloud Knights were able to march with their breath held, they would be doomed to fall into disarray. Moreover, I can handle it. No one can know whether their comrade was about to be stricken with Mara. Actually, Is there I can't. Anything better than fear for destroying the morale of an army? <laughs> we also attack teammates. The Cloud Knights' first assault was just a cover. Yeah. You're using the main army to attract the enemy's attention. While we douse the elixir crucibles and stop the smoke. Wow. Not. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus renounced their century of secrecy and chose to reveal themselves, meaning they feel confident of victory. But no matter how well prepared they may be, their focus has always been the Cloud Knights. Right. They are completely unaware of your existence and capacity, and in short, cannot be prepared against you so this is the main name of the game we're just the variable always want to get foxians and <laughs> to try vidyahara Vid vidyadhara smoke can't affect us also good question i'm sure we'll have gas masks <laughs> indeed Wow. This demonic vapor is a weapon targeted against the Cloud Knights. Wow, okay, so we are fundamentally different in DNA too? The Ambrosial Arbor is taboo for the La Fu. Mm -hmm. And the Sien Alliance has always been fiercely independent. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus can never have guessed that the General would seek outside help. Right. They won't be prepared against short life species. <laughs> it feels so... <laughs> Why does it feel like it's, it's meant so negatively? It doesn't feel like a compliment. Is this what General Jing Yuan meant by unexpected guests? I guess so. I wouldn't hazard a guess. Uh, well, I did I literally the guess. The of the Stellaron Hunters were more accurate than mine. The future that Kafka seeks is becoming reality. One step at a time. It is scripted. Fushuan, it's scripted. This is the only way. Rather, the thing is, only this way leads to the known best result. Yeah. If we can afford to choose, then none would choose to leap off a cliff. Well, the point to me is, if Kafka can, if Kafka has the script of what's supposed to happen, we could be like, you know what? I'm gonna do something completely random. But that's probably gonna be the script too. Like that's what's so that's what's so stupid. There is no working around it. No matter what, we will probably not be a variable in her plan. Maybe, like, later, we'll do something completely insane. But even then, I feel like that would be in the script, too. That's why I don't like it when there's a supposed script. And that's why I don't like stories about fate and, like, guaranteed futures. I need to blow my nose. Give me a sec. Because if this whole fate thing exists for real, it's like, it doesn't matter what you do. It just doesn't. You can be like, I'm going to do something crazy. That won't change anything, because that will have been seen by fate, essentially. You probably get what I'm trying to say. Besides. This is not my decision alone. Okay. The duty of the Master Diviner is to bring luck and avoid misfortune. Sure. I don't want my choice to plunge the Lafu into a terrible fate. Oh, so it's about you. To return to the matter at hand, only you can douse the Elixir Crucibles without being harmed by them. Mm-hmm. What say you? I say I will see you on the next life, because I'm not doing it. <laughs> Fine. I didn't hear a please, but... Hmm. As we do kind of have superpowers around here. Mr. Yang, what do you think? Tell me. Nod. I nice. will come at once from the smoke. He thinks nod. Place. You won't be left to fend for yourselves. Alright. Oh, I'm excited for that. Hopefully get to trial her. Oh. 
Hey, I, I told you, I took this, I took this picture before it even became a thing. I think my picture is nicer. This thing is kind of ugly. Don't forget to stay hydrated. <gasps> what? <laughs> what? It's not too late to practice holding my breath. <laughs> You're a bum. You seem quite all right. We're still far from the elixir crucible. Mm -hmm. I'm no healer, but I do know that dosage is important in the application of poison. Probably better to not come in contact with it at all. Just a thought. Even so. Okay, I admit it. Mm -hmm. I'm terrified. <laughs> I'm still young. I don't want to become more stressed. So this is what you hear from every young person here. And you'd better return to the home front. Out of the question. Jing Yuan gave me authority over <laughs> If I can't stand I actually really like her. Then how can I succeed him as a general? <clears throat> how can I win the hearts of the people? Right, 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 right. Is that smoke really safe, though? I mean, I believe it. How large are the disciples of bit of the forces? Only a handful of converted alchemists and healers. Oh. They can drive fantastic creatures into battle and strengthen their bodies with medicinal pellets. I see. But they are no match for the Cloud Knight. Mm-hmm. That's why they decided to spread this demonic vapor. Uh-huh. There is a gulf well, I have a deja vu right now. Us, yet they still emerged into the open and rebel. Something isn't right. They must be waiting for some shift in fortune. This is a cool shot. All right, I'll leave you to it. I will come at once when the crucibles are doused and the smoke dissipates. All right, chief. Good luck. Let me just break your vase in the meantime. Basic ingredients. I feel like even though long life species get to live forever. Yeah. They aren't so different from us short life species when it comes to worries and suffering. Well, no one wants to die. So even if you live for a way longer time, Oh, that scared the crap out of me. Premature death is never what you want. Of course they're similar in that way. 69 meters away, let's go. Little <laughs> fold-out bridge. Um, okay. Will of preservation. Little draw. Little bunk. Yeah. Real. Thank you for the concern, but I'm fine. Huh? The general commanded me to stay with you. What? I dare not go against military orders. Tingyun? Your life is more important, Miss Tingyun. Yeah, please, what go the back. hell? We can explain to the general. <laughs> there is really no need. Tingyun! spent my years traveling the universe. Not to mention, I'm younger and stronger Fuck off. than I look. Go away. Even you benefactors have probably lived longer than me. Really? I mean, wealth probably has. What? Ting Yun, what the frick? Okay, is Ting Yun evil? Turn off. Boonk. That was easy. Crucible gradually stops shaking and the smoke ceases to pour out. like the smoke is getting thinner. Nice, dude. Not thin enough. We need to hurry. Um... Okay, Sushung would work against this guy and this guy. <laughs> they don't know. Crucible starts to shake his focus with Crucible. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> turn it off. Oh. <laughs> Damn it, why did I heal? I didn't need it. You know, running in a straight line actually works against those, but I was like, nah, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be a funny guy. Ow, I'm not living this. That's the one downside of being a short life species. We die here, we die forever. Mm, bonk, nor. Okay, I thought they lived again. I'm getting baited often by it. All right. Use the jar, close the jar, do the jar, dar, jar, dar. Neat. We didn't even get any message about that one. Ooh. I'm gonna stop here. Uh, excellent. I'll lead my troops to the rendezvous. What are you still holding your breath? <laughs> no. So you succeed. Master of the Cyber Science Medicus. Is it is this is this Don Chu? Unimportant. The inevitable is already upon us. Her eyes are bound, it would make sense if it was Don Chu. Don Chu. Yep. It's you. No. Okay. Wow. I have met you before in my capacity as chief alchemist, master diviner. 
You don't seem surprised. <laughs> That's kind of crazy. I, so I wonder what would have happened if we did beat her up. Indeed. The general and I knew that the disciples of Sanctus Medicus must be hiding in the Alchemy Commission. Uh huh. However, without evidence, we couldn't bring charges before the commissions. We had to wait for you to show yourselves. Wow. And now, your charges are many. <laughs> Drawing Stellaron's spirits into the sea and <laughs> Wow. Resurrecting the Ambrosial Arbor. Striking down our people with Mara. The Ten Lords Commission will address these transgressions <laughs> during your reckoning. <laughs> She's like, but I'm, I'm not going to jail. I just, I refuse. I, I'm a criminal already. <laughs> Sienjo ancestors are also guilty. Uh-huh. They were the ones who accepted the blessings of the abundance and turned their right. descendants into long life species. Yeah. The disciples of Sanctus Medicus are only walking on the road our ancestors once took. Mm -hmm. How is it a crime to seek ascendance? I think it's the way you're doing it, most likely. In days of old, the roots of the Ambrosial Arbor She's got one of those Ning Wong fingers. Like a living creature. We controlled the stellar seas, and none could stand in our way. Everyone could become celestial and shift form at will. Yeah. Divine miracles it sounds pretty cool. To all nine Sanjo ships. What a glorious time that was. Wait, so you were alive back then? You are like that long life of the species? How far the Sanjo has fallen. We consent to be commanded by the devilish archer. <laughs> Suffer continuously at the hands of the denizens of abundance. Wow. And the Ten Lords Commission even forces us to give up our immortality. Uh huh. How pitiful. I do not blame you Damn for it. your ignorance. We were not born in the era when the Ambrosial Arbor first descended. Okay, so she is like a hundred thousand years old. It's miracles. But now. We now have an opportunity to restore the ancient laws. Uh-huh. <laughs> Forgive me for thinking you might have harbored some profound enlightenment. <laughs> Yours is the same old talk of those who seek power and give up on their humanity. Queen. Our Queen shit. Our ancestors fought side by side with the Arbiter, laid waste to the Arbor, and established the Ten Lords Commission to lay down the lines between life and death. In doing so, we enshrined our future as human beings. No queen. Celestials? Little there tiny queen. No celestials <laughs> Sorry. Sanjo. The divine miracles of the abundance, mm -hmm. the manipulation of life and death. Your deeds are nothing but evil. True. I have nothing to say to you, Master Diviner. <gasps> you have already made your decision. But so have you. You have discarded power. A most foolish choice. Uh-huh. I wonder if our interaction with her is going to be any different. Because, like, you know, we didn't kill her? Wow. She just fights us anyway? I'm doomed! Stop it. Alright. What are Celestials capable of? One more roll? One more roll. Always lucky. That's the one more right there. Okay, interesting. So Don Shu's just still around. I thought she might leave or something. Now she did tell us to leave the ship as a whole. I I'm messing up right now. That was bad. I can taunt. She did tell us to leave the ship, uh, which we didn't listen to. So it, bro, that taunt means nothing if they can still AOE, <laughs> which we didn't listen to. I do find it weird that she didn't say anything to us though. I would have liked that, but. Maybe I'm asking for a lot, I don't know. I kind of like being being in this position where fights are difficult though. It's more exciting. Although I'm pretty sure this is not suppo Ow, supposed to be difficult. Ah, no! No, QQ. I'm QQing right now. Do you get the reference, guys? QQing. It's, it's like crying. Oh, I feel like QQ is not a crying character at all. Don't tell me there's another wave. I could not- Oh, lordy me. Oh lordy me, it's Don Shu herself. What? Prana what now? Prana you what? Light cone. I'm only looking Decreased maximum recoverable HP. It's fine, I can barely heal anyway. I'm weak. We can take this guy out, so he just doesn't move. Seems good to me. He didn't get the thing off on us either. Do a little bop. Um, I will be doing a taunt. 
Holy moly, this is not looking good. <laughs> at least my, uh, look at that, my Nat heals to full now. She's just that good. Maybe this is the fight we would have had if I decided to punch her? I never know. Oh, guys. Oh, guys, I might have to not do the cannon run. <laughs> Don't do it. Black Prana Snare will be used on the next action. I don't know what you're, what you're, what you're saying to me. Yappa. Unremovable. On all enemies. Oh lord. Can I... Yes. Big. Really big. I had to go for Nat first, because I think if I took the turn to Sushong, I would have died. <laughs> I would have died from the wind shear. Yeah, that one right there. Okay, this is bad. Okay, the snare doesn't actually matter. Oh! Oh! Oh no! Oh, no. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> oh no. Alright, here we go again. I don't care about max health if I'm always shielded. <laughs> Real facts. It dealt nothing, look at that. That's crazy. That's crazy that my characters are that much weaker on the other team. I think Gep is my most well-built character though, so it kind of makes sense. Bonk. There we go. Who is she? Did Kafka bait you? <laughs> Did Kafka bait you as well? Okay, sure. <laughs> who gave you the Stellaron? Oh god. Oh God! <laughs> Wait, the music has got a calm still. We're chilling. As long as I don't press click, we'll be fine. Okay, there it is. You force me to intervene directly. I'm loath to flout my philosophy of destruction. I think. I think she's like possessed or some shit. There's no way. There's it. I mean, it, they were hinting at this so hard. Never mind. It would seem the time has come for other means of dismantling the Sienjo from within. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <sighs> what a shame. Really? Uh, it would have been nice to observe for a little longer. <laughs> wow, that laugh too. You received the gift of abundance. <laughs> what? Ew! Ew! What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> so she was being possessed. I hate those eyes and the neck snap. Bro, that's nasty. To set in motion the self-destruction of the Sienjo. Fantilia. Miss Have I seen this character in SU yet? The Lord Ravager of the Antimatter Legion? But uh, how can that be? Uh, she got possessed, there's no way. Keep calm, all of you. <laughs> what the hell? We have to stay together. What the actual hell? Draw two. Draw two get lucky. Draw two get always a fuck. <laughs> We're doomed. I don't have a healer. There's three waves. This is actually doomed. Bro, I actually... You know what? I've always... I'm gonna say it. There's some deep me lore. I've always disliked anime because I remember being very young and seeing a scene like that with the same big open eyes and like a neck snap and I've felt uncomfortable about anime ever since. That's all like that's my reference to it. I know there's also cute anime and whatever and funny anime but my reference to it has always been hella weird and that right there reminded me of that so much. What the hell? What the hell? Is she just dead in canon? Her neck snapped! <laughs> what the hell? Okay, not gonna lie, people told me this story was wild, and I believed them, but this- this is a step beyond what I thought it would be! What the- what? No, what the hell are you on about? What? I'm still- the thing is, right, I- I'm very slow with things like lore, and in Genshin I'm kinda- I'm kinda established now, like I understand most things. 
But in this game, I'm I'm not very uh, um, like knowledgeable with the terminology yet, so I'm not sure if I'm misunderstanding something. But I I think I think that wasn't like I feel like Ting Yun wasn't this the entire time. I don't know if I'm saying it. I should have probably chickened there, honestly. Uh, do you get what I'm trying to say? Like, I feel like Ting Yun might have not just always been bad. We'll probably get to it. I also don't know why if Ting Yun was bad, she'd snap her own. <laughs> Definitely possessed, definitely possessed, guys. Real. I did get healed in between waves. I think they're pitying me. Hello. Selenova never set their gaze. I don't know who those are, I'm sorry. I don't understand what you're saying. I see. Uh huh. Oh. You can steal the show. You could have, you know, we could have just done. You didn't have to fight me to steal the show. No. They don't seem that strong, not gonna lie. I say that while getting healed in between every round. Okay, okay, they're really strong. Please don't kill Gap. Please don't kill Gap. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna use Branya E to use Gap E. The most defensive play you've ever seen. But Gap does big damage. Look. Bang, bang, boom. Huge 1.6k, dude. That ew. That's so nasty. That's actually. I'm still not over the neck snap. That's so disgusting. <laughs> ew, ew, ew. <laughs> I'm still like. I'm jittery over this. What the hell, man? <laughs> that was definitely unexpected. I'm glad though. So the ads didn't really spoil me on that, thankfully. Oh, I'm gonna see that in my sleep, man. That face before death. No, 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 no. My turn. Oh. <laughs> okay, wild though. I like this a lot. There's definitely, you know. I, we always talk about how um, Honkai Impact 3rd, which I do plan on playing still, will be on this channel as well, on the second channel. Honkai Impact 3rd always had this, like, uh, more, more edge, you know? More, like, crazy, more creepy, more direct, like, less child-friendly to it. And everyone was like, yeah, I wonder when Genshin's gonna be like that. It, the, more, the more it comes to it, the more it seems like Genshin will never be like that. It's kind of just more child-friendly, while the Honkai games are... <laughs> They're raw! <laughs> so, I really feel like, just with that, the Honkai Staro has already taken the cake over being way more wild than Genshin. <laughs> okay, deep breaths. It's okay. It's just a video game. What the hell? I'm still- oh. oh, I'm still getting, like, weird chills from it. Oh my god. Svasanishu. Please tell me I'm not like March, and I'm like not as stupid. And everyone's like, "No, she got possessed, bro. Didn't you see the soul leave her body?" And what was that fire that came out of her? And her body? Where did it go? Don't tell me she was actually bad the whole time. <laughs> Mr. Yang, you're smart. What happened just now? I would have never guessed that plot twist. Usually, I like to I like to guess some plot twists or whatever, but that one that was beyond me. I'll stay silent too. I don't know, dude. He stays silent too. The flame we witnessed claimed to be Lord Ravager Fantilia. Okay. A name I've heard other nameless speak of in the past. Yes. She's one of seven Lord Ravagers who serve Nanook. Fair enough. And finds pleasure in witnessing the self destruction of mortals. Mm hmm. She's led countless souls down a dark and hopeless. So, what you're saying is she's a bitch. <laughs> Meaning that Ting Yun had long since fallen under the Lord Ravager's influence? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Okay. But that's like she was being possessed, right? Please. I don't believe so. Okay. Fantilia revels in watching a corrupted mind eating away its host from inside out. Uh huh. Until the obliteration of both is achieved. I see. But. There was no indication that Ting Yun had been misguided or manipulated. It's possible that the Ting Yun we knew wasn't her <sighs> true self. Okay. But an image Fantilia devised to serve her own purposes. 
Okay, wait. <laughs> wait. I can't get that image of her snapping the neck. That's so nasty. I can't get it out of my head. Tingy has been misguided or manipulated. It's possible that the Tingy we knew wasn't her true self, but an image fantasy uh, device to serve her own purposes. So this means there's a real Ting Yun out there, and this was never a real Ting Yun? Like she was using an image? Maybe Ting Yun's trapped somewhere. It was weird when Ting Yun said that she had like so much experience, you know, with the boats and shit. She'd, she'd been doing that for a hundred thousand years. And then when we got here, she was like, you know, I've been like alive for less long than you. So maybe it was just like a vessel. And a real thing in somewhere out there. I hope so. Anyway, I don't know. That that's so scary now though. I feel like, you know, on the picture there's like in the event tab, and there's like a little giggle, and that person had like green hair. So now I'm scared that I'm scared that Yukong also bad. <laughs> Yukong also manipulated. Okay, I, I I don't know. I'm still confused. I'm just not gonna say anything. You're saying that the real Ting Yun is still Yeah. I'm Sorry, Marge, I can't <laughs> say with any certainty where the real Ting Yun may be, or at what point she was replaced by the imposter. Okay. Without knowing where the body vanished to, it'll be tough to get an answer. Happily, I'm a stalker, and I wanted to know where she lived, so I put a tracker on her body. <laughs> that would be a plot twist right there. At this point, <laughs> it's all just conjecture and hope. Uh-huh. But... If that body belonged to the real Ting Yun, it does raise the question of why Fantilia would go to Fantilia. such a place to destroy any evidence of her. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't it be more in line with her destructive nature to leave Ting Yun's remains behind as a, a display of power? Yeah, and to frighten us and scar us for life. I believe this. I, st to I hate Fantilia's it, man. Goal. The tiny eyes of so <laughs> seem to doubt among us and ensnare <sighs> us in a malevolent trap. Yeah. Can't trust anyone, guys. I don't trust March anymore. March, do not snap your own neck. I beg. I'm sorry. I I'm promise I'm getting over it soon. I promise. Yes, indeed. Fantilia is aiming for the Ambrosial Arbor. If she succeeds, the Lofu will be deprived of its roots, making its destruction all too easy. We must stop her. Yeah, I mean, I think that was the plan no matter what. Undestroyed letter. What is this? Your Highness, clamor battles about me much remains. Great for your constant protection, ensuring that all above and does not go f that does not falter. We cannot express or appreciate enough. Dear grateful exiled. With his letter, I send a servant to deliver ten samples for experimentation. Your ob 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 obedient servant, Gauchin. Gauchin, what the hell are you on about? Signed only with a casually drawn talisman. The Ambrosial Arbor can be sealed from that cell. Yeah, same. Let's make haste. <laughs> Let's make haste, I say, slowly walking. I don't know, you maybe you have more dialogue for me. Oh, Ting Yun used to drive those before <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh my god, I'm, oh, I'm still not over it. Give me, give me a second, give me a breather. Take a little sip, <laughs> another sip. Oh, actually, like stiff neck right now. There's nothing to do with the story, I'm sure. Had the audacity to carry out her nefarious plans right under our noses. Yeah. How utterly despicable. I know. What worries I know. Me more is just how many more antimatter saboteurs are at large. Don't start thinking about it too much. That's how they get us to go insane. About Ting Yun. It all happened so suddenly. I know. But looking back. I think Mr. Yang was right. Ting Yun was behaving strangely. She was fascinated with the Abundance's creation. Sure. Since she was an Amicaster dispatched by the Skyfaring Commission, mm -hmm. it's evident that there must indeed be a person with her name in the Commission. Yeah. We'll have to let the Cloud Knights get to the bottom of what happened to the real Ting Yun. That's gonna be a real cool arc as well. As for the Ting Yun who accompanied us all that way, mm -hmm. it's like what Mr. Yang said. Her appearance was designed to sow seeds of doubt among us. We cannot allow ourselves to fall into her trap. I find it so odd that she was a playable character for so long. And like that, I think that's kind of what... It's kind of a, a fake safety that Genshin has given me. When a character is playable before you know anything about them, it feels like you can trust them because it's like, oh, they're playable, you know? They're not going to die. They're not going to backstab you. They're an ally because you get to play as them. But... <laughs> 
<laughs> I mean, of course, this wasn't the real Ting Yun, but still, the way it happened was wild. Uh, about the Scale Gorge waterscape. It is a delve governed by the Vidyatara. <coughs> Supposedly Sorry. an ancient oceanic region transferred from the Vidyatara home planet. Vidyahara. After the Ambrosial Arbor Sounds very Sumeru like during the war, its roots were left gnarled and broken. Mm -hmm. Yet it never died. I see. The Alliance decided to seal the arbor within Scale Gorge waterscape. Yep. And trust it to the high elders of the Vidyatara. And rely on the power of long scions to constrain it. Long scions. It has been so long. No one knows whether the seal remains. Mm -hmm. Even if it does, I doubt it will hinder that spectral Lord Ravager. Fair. Where's King? I've reported the current situation to the seat of divine foresight. Okay. He made no further contact after we communicated at the Matrix of Prescience. Mm -hmm. He said he had important matters to personally attend to. How vague and sus. <laughs> There's gonna be more plot twists this quest. There have to. The situation stands on the edge of a precipice. We must trust in the general. I do, I do. I'm sure he's got a he's got a plan. Time is of the essence. Let's go. I'm sure he has an idea. Yeah, he, he can't just be doing this. Oh, whatever. A while ago, Don Hong. Yeah, uh, Sushan. Let's go. Is... Town, the Alchemy Commission, <laughs> the Delve bordering Scale Gorge Waterscape. I know because I lived here. <laughs> You're pretty familiar with this place. I love Sushan's voice. She actually makes me happy. Yep. The Alchemy Commission. No wonder we were getting those military broadcasts on the way over. Mm -hmm. uh, something about the Cloud Knights gathering here, right? Uh, they're probably coming to fix the Stellaron problem. Mm -hmm. uh, it's been such a long journey, but now we're finally going to meet some Cloud Knights. I'll be back with my unit. Wait, you're Cloud Knight too? What do you mean finally meeting some? Uh, you know what I'm thinking? I, I still have the idea that in... Uh, I forgot his name. Le... The whatever in his coffin, there's something that's gonna be relating to this quest. I don't know. It felt so sus that he just had one. It's like, yeah, there's someone in here, friend, no, foe, no. <laughs> like, there's something in there, uh, and he's doing it for someone. That's odd to me. And like, maybe with, with all the Don Hong spoilers I've seen in advertisements, I feel like maybe he's gonna he's like one of the evil ones, but he. He turned coded and that the evil ones are after him or something. And now he's, he's using his powers for good. Something like that. Which would definitely make Don Hong a lot cooler than just, oh, guys, it's another quiet, like deadly you, type. Right? I told you I'd bring you somewhere safe, and I did. Mm hmm. Though, we did take a bit of a detour. <laughs> I love him. I hope we get to see more of him. What's your name again? Locha. No, I had a diviner read my fortune for the journey ahead. Mm -hmm. He told me not to be concerned with the destination, but to seize my chances and travel with the current to reap the greatest harvest. Cool. I like the mindset. I'm way too scared to do that, but I'd love to be able to f like free my head and do that. Meaning? Go with the flow. What do you mean? mean? Thank you, Miss Sushi. <laughs> I like it a lot. What I've also noticed, I really like that the hair in front of their face is like kind of transparent. You can see through it. You can still see their eyes. I think that's so cool. Oh, Neat way to do it. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go report to the nearest captain. You do that. You guys can hang around here, but don't run off too far. There will be cloud knights coming to escort you back soon. Okay. Uh, bye for now. Bye bye. I love her outfit. I love way too many things about Sushan. Daniel, hey, it's me. I'm DMing myself. Oh, that's crazy. Let's go with them. Your homeland's got some big, really big crucibles. <laughs> this is weird. How am I texting myself? But message failed again. The messages never get sent. I wonder what's happening with those three. Tingyun's neck got snapped. The Cloud Knights seem to be <laughs> gathering for the Stellaron disaster. Uh huh. But why did Kafka want us to come here? I don't know. What happened to them? Yeah. And what happened to Blade? Well, they seem to have, like, fake escaped. Delayed for too long. I need more information. Yeah. Let's have a little chat. I wonder if this advanced at all. Like, is this guy even more insane now? Master was defeated? Oh, yeah. No. No, that cannot be. It happened. You do get some nice fashion, though. Look at that. You get some new boots and stuff that match everything. Kind of cool. Kind of cool. Not gonna lie. How about you guys? You still have nothing to say? It's cool to see that they kind of updated the dialogue. Sushong, What's up? I need to go. Go? Go where? Yeah, well... The Cloud Knight's operation isn't over yet. I have friends. Relax. 
And when the fight is over, I'll personally escort you and Mr. Lo Cha home. You're very sweet, Sushang, but you don't understand. You don't understand, my lady. Oh, that's this prisoner. This prisoner is going to look like an idiot. Oh, my heart, no. The master must have failed to summon the protection of Sanctus Medicus. Mm -hmm. Her will must have waited. Yeah, that's what it is. Just you wait. I'll show you the blessing of Sanctus Medicus. Stab him. Bam. You guys can cut him. It doesn't matter anymore. <laughs> He's of no use to us anymore. <laughs> this is crazy, man. Thanks hey. Those heroes I managed to pull through. Let's go. Could those guests of the general be the galaxy rangers of all yes sir yes sir let's go Lord, you what's up, dude? haven't been back home for a long time have you master don hung you know too much locha how did you know light this isn't my home <laughs> there's the we can't lie to this dude as home draws nearer so our feelings grow stronger uh-huh i can see it in your eyes that's definitely true do you want to leave then do it now i love this guy the Cloud Knights will soon check our identities. I have somewhere else. To <laughs> what are you? What are you? Wh where are you going? Yeah, that's that's confidential, my brother. I'm a traveling merchant. I have one more deal to see. Through. It's the chest, I tell you. It's the coffin, man. Locha, I don't. You haven't been back. Oh, is that? Do you want to leave? The cloud I wanted to see what he says. I'm a traveling merchant. Okay, he says the same thing, you but like he. I want to be honest with him. I don't know if that it has impact. I'm a traveling Dude, I want, this is so crazy. I want to know everything about them. Hello. The Star's gift connections are being reinstated. Uh huh. The people stranded at the Alchemy Commission should all be able to leave soon. I'll be the first. I'll be running. Look at me. Bam! Attack boost. Running away. I remember her standing here before her neck snapped. I'm sorry. Ah. Uh, hey. Good Excited. Front lines. <laughs> the disciples over at Eve Mist Mansion have been defeated. Yes. Lovely. Lovely news. Well, this should give us an idea. Like, this should give Don Hong an idea. Right? The disciples of Sanctus Medicus started a rebellion in the Alchemy Commission. Mm -hmm. The Cloud Knights have the area locked down. Yeah. It's not safe. Please, remain here for now. Psych. Send someone oh. to escort you back once the operation is over. Psych. Disciples of Sanctus Medicus. Lunatics. Oh. <laughs> You saw the Ambrosial <laughs> Arbor, I assume. Yeah, dude. I, I saw it. The work of those sorcerers. Yes. Still, I can't say too much. Military secrecy. I wonder where the girl is that we like the robot, the half puppet girl that Locha healed. I wonder where, what happened to her because we went with her. Connected to the disciples' rebellion. Uh huh. I've heard those uh -oh. names before, but when? Uh oh. How did the others get drawn into all this? Hey, that's me. You seen any Outworlders? Briefly described the captain in the appearance of March 7th and the crew. You must be talking about the general's guests. Yes. Are they your friends? I happen to also be a guest. Oh, what a coincidence. They left with the Master Diviner not long ago. Mm-hmm. That's all thanks to their courageous work that the knights don't have to worry about the poison in Eve Mist Mansion. Uh-huh. I received the good news from the front lines. They'll probably be back soon. Hype. Thanks. Strange. Huh. You seem oddly familiar to me. <laughs> it's me, your son. Never mind. Too many misfortunes recently. I can hardly think straight. Fair enough, my lady. Have a nice day. I know what to say to this thing, because I'm Don Hung. Come on, I wouldn't know. You guys won't hold me back, right? You know what I gotta say? I really like Don Hung's little outfit. I'd wear this. I'd wear this, like, normally. I'm sorry. I have to catch up to my friends. Thank you for looking out for me on this journey. This is cute. Both of you. This is cute. I like Don Hung a lot because of this. I, he's grown on me, but like his the the boring people were simping for him before he had any spicy. What? Oh wait, this has effect on me. The smoke, perhaps. What a huge cauldron. Past echo. This orient cauldron is, is driven by, by the cloud hymn magic of our people. The uh huh. It drinks the water of the ancient sea like mm -hmm. a whale swallows the tide. Sounds hype. So it's in the sea. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> but I turned off the smoke, though. This is baloney. Yeah. Train some martial arts while we're on here. Never a waste of time as a Cloud Knight. Or ex-Cloud Knight. Or fugitive Cloud Knight. Or... Haha, <laughs> Cloud Knight. <laughs> it's cause he's good because he's, like, the most popular. Anyway. 
<laughs> Gaming. All right, we're gonna walk again, but... Oh! Is that Tiny Don Hong? Is that Mini Daniel? Maybe not. You should take this chance to learn more, young master. Okay. Uh-huh. But I don't need any sort of device to help me command water. Wow. What more is there to learn? Okay. You are indeed the chosen one. The chosen the one. Potential. Yet cloud him magic is just the beginning. Okay. Of Vidyadara Mirajako? Uh-huh. Have these shadows of the past yet to disperse? Uh, I don't know. We haven't these seen them. Memories. No. They have nothing to do with me anymore. Are you sure about that? All the elixir crews of They're saying the same thing. Okay. Wow. We're getting some real <laughs> some real deep lore. I'm leaving. Let me out. I don't want to see it anymore. <laughs> Kinda wild, guys. Is this me? Like Daniel? Uh-uh. Long. Uh -uh. Long. I was exiled from the Shenzhou. I'm no longer one of the Scions of Permanence. Oh, oh god. <laughs> Whoa. Hello. I doubt I will be here to see you take charge. No need to feel Well, he left, so... Uh huh. They got little fins. It looks like. Are they fish people? Oh. So these the scales are probably the dragon people then. This is what um what the little healer girl taught us told us about. I'm pretty sure. They die and then they're reborn. Is that what the blessing of like is that what, eternal life? They're dragons. They just get reborn. Nah. Uh oh. Nah, it's not me. You're an echo from the past, not the present. Stop talking to me like I'm here right now. I'm stealing this boat. <laughs> what? This is all in Elio's script. I hate it. I'm sorry. I cannot linger here. My friends have left. This ghost is I always looking at me, by the way. A bit creepy. Cool. And then she just helps him. <laughs> don't do it! Don't do it! I'm gonna do it. Okay, fine. Here's the boat. <laughs> thanks. Say thanks. Daniel? Daniel cutscene. He's reconnecting with the Daniel from the past. This is just a normal boat. This ain't no flying boat at all. Cool shot, though. Very cool shot. He's here. Dude. <laughs> Dude. Hmm. Right on time. This is so... I, I don't know if I like or dislike it. Feeling Kafka, it's welling up within me. Uh huh. That feeling, it, it's Daniel. Well, don't resist. Let the Mara strike you. Really? Hello, it's me, Daniel. You're here. What's up, Blade? <laughs> In madness. <laughs> <laughs> His mouth barely moving. It's time. You also look kind of insane. You think changing form will help you escape? Escape. <laughs> <laughs> I've told you and that woman many times. And that woman. I am Don Hung. Okay. So we're gonna hear his name of old. I am no longer. The VIP of this religion, or whatever. Nothing to do with your past. Okay. Don Hung. <laughs> the sin of your past, you huh? Another name and face can blot out the sin of your past. You. You 
didn't even experience death. Okay, so what? I will force this suffering upon you, Don Hung. <laughs> you will know the pain of death. There's no need, Blade. <laughs> Not on my watch. Who's that? Hmm. Not on my watch. Who speaks like that? Do we know them? Oh. You're not murdering anyone today. Yo. You're coming with me. What's up, my boy? I can't believe he's here. Ching Yuan's lapdog. Lapdog. <laughs> Did the general not teach you to choose your battles wisely? This is cool. Okay, unexpected. Hey, move back. Things are about to. Huh? What? <laughs> hey, it's me. They remember each other. What is this, like, sunlight in the back? They always put Don Hong in the most scenic angles, like... You, you look so familiar. It's me. Not Daniel Hung. Let me transform. <laughs> look out! Hey, stop smiling like that. That's creepy, dude. Uh-oh. It's gonna happen. Yo, my boy got some skills too, though. I love this. If anything, it reminds me of Irelia. Oh, he killed already? Don. I mean, I don't know. I wasn't there for it. He's a cool dragon, though. Really? <laughs> this is insane, though. He can be revived anyway. Look at him. Wait. First it was the Stellaron Hunters. I thought now I was him. Criminal has infiltrated the Sienja. <laughs> I thought I was him, but <laughs> I'm his enemy. I came to ensure the safety of my friends. This is wild. I don't get to play by the way. This is all auto. Out of the way. Be afraid. Oh, I do get to play. Destroy all the flying swords? We don't know its weakness either? What am I? I'm Imaginary. Okay. Whoa. Cannot view detailed info. Nice. He reminds me of Aurelia. A lot. But I'm afraid you won't be seeing your friends. Oh. They're caught in their own bitter struggle. Oh, are we gonna flash back there now? So <laughs> let's heat things up then. Kafka. What the hell is going Listen on? Me. Unleash the morrow. Listen to me. So it begins. Oh. That explains that move. But how are we both story yet I'm controlling me? Maybe I should speed it up a little bit, huh? Let's go for it. Surrender. Surrender. No. I'm friendly. My boy. He is so cool, though. Afraid to hurt the boy. I'd rather not punch the boy, to be honest. Yeah. I wonder if the others are okay. <laughs> He's just thinking about us in the meantime. Gotta make this quick. This is incredible. Well, he's actually kind of kicking their ass. Oh. So familiar. Really. Who is she? Dude, there's wit. Stop saying so many things I can't understand. Use the skills and enhance Don Hong, Inbibitor Lune's basic attack for three consecutive turns. Use Fulgrant Leap. Jesus. Jesus. 60k, just like that. Okay. Cool character, guys. Glad I pulled for Kafka. Does 10 damage. But at least she's cool. 
I think Kafka's definitely the Kafka's definitely some kind of archon or some shit. Like the fact her text is sometimes like this, and like there's so much emphasis on it. She's definitely she's the god of everything or something. Well, Blady, are you satisfied? I don't know what could have potentially been satisfying about any of this. <sighs> no. I have killed Don Hong. <laughs> <laughs> He's just standing there. How unusual. <laughs> what? What do you want? We're just two edgy boys being edgy boys a couple feet apart. <laughs> what did you do? What did she do? I'm just clearing the stage for the grand entrance. All right. Can't have you three misbehaving in front of the Lafu's hotshot general. Okay. <laughs> Bro, <sighs> too much is happening. This is overwhelming. Get up, my son. Nice fight, though. Jing Yuan. Yes. General. Hello, my son. Get up. Off your knees. No way to present yourself. <laughs> Hello, Daniel. Good to see you, Traitor. Many years have passed since the two of you departed the Sienjo, and yet the circumstances of your return appear to be equally unhappy. <laughs> if you still thought of me as a friend, you should have forewarned me. <laughs> My task is complete. What was your task? Killing Don Hong's first sheep? Mm, that it is. Thank you for assisting the Sienjo in this small matter. <laughs> Take this person away. I will pretend I didn't see anything this time. <laughs> you know what this feels like? This feels like Nahida trading, like handling with uh, the Tore. That's the kind of vibe I, I'm getting from this. General, I. You did great, young man. Now is not the time. Oh, shut up, young man. <laughs> so they're. Just leaving. Cool. It has been a long time, old friend. <laughs> I'm not him. <laughs> mm. I'm sorry. Uh. There's no need to be. Goodbye. You cannot leave yet. Your Astral Express friends are waiting for you in Scale Gorge Waters. <laughs> Shall we go and see them together? <laughs> There's this incredible tension for no reason. Like, th everything that's happening is so nuts. I think it's because the game has been so slow so far. So, ma so many things happening at once now is wild. So is this going to be the big dragon reveal? Lunarescent depths. Wow. A realm of singular beauty. This looks like a boss fight Still area if I've ever seen one. is the same as when I last laid eyes on it. Uh -huh. And here we stand so different from one another. The flesh of long life species may be immortal, but the constant of heaven and earth eludes them. Yeah. You know the Vidyata are hatching rebirth cycle, General. The waters of the ancient sea have cleansed Don Fung of his past sin. Don Fung. The person <laughs> that once stood here alongside you is no more. So I guess Don is just like a, a title, a pre-title. I, when, I, when I heard the Don Shu person, I was like... I kind of laid the link, but I was like, it, that's... There's no way they're related. I did not expect that at all. I was going to make a joke about it, but I was like... <laughs> Don and Don, so crazy. But it seems like everything relating to that starts with Don? I don't know. Don Fong. Person once stood there alongside you is no more. I am Don Hung. <laughs> Whether Don Fung was hero or villain has nothing to do with me. I'm not Retnos. I am Pednos. <laughs> accepted my eternal banishment without complaint. Mm -hmm. But do not let his shadow cloud your estimation of me, General. So was he never the same person, or as he said that he changed? Because if it if it never was him, that shit sucks. <sighs> Raising old nets only darkens the water. An exercise in unhappiness. Perhaps it is your visage, the horns on your head, 
or the unmistakable air of the High Elder that makes the separation nigh impossible for me. <laughs> I already told you, I... You did. Uh. But to what effect? <laughs> if words alone were enough to change the heart, this world would be without quarrel. Uh-huh. If you wish to rid me of the illusion of Don Fung... He's... You must do something for me. He's way too smart. He's just asking for favors from everyone. <laughs> I don't know why everyone's accepting it every time. He's like, listen, you have to do this for me. <laughs> and then even Kafka and like Blade or whatever agree. And uh, we're also, I mean, he's indebted to us technically. But that's what Kafka's, there's so many layers to this. It's like we're watching Shrek. Before I can let Don Fong die and revoke your banishment edict. Mm-hmm. I need him to do me one final favor. I see. I can guarantee you that when it is done, you will no longer walk in anyone's shadow aboard the Law Fu. Interesting. I may not be capable of the things that Dan Fung was capable of. Okay. You must do it, or my promise will count for naught. <laughs> if you wish to blame someone, you're like a strict dad. Your previous incarnation. Okay. Have you not committed that terrible sin. Had the power of dragon transmutation been passed on intact, I would have no need to compel you. So it was, okay, it was before his rebirth. As he uses the dragon, he just, you know, respawns in the egg every time. And so, his previous life... So, I guess, reincarnation wouldn't be exactly the same per- I don't know. It kind of depends how you look at it. But it is him, essentially. Had he not committed that terrible sin, the power of dragon transmutation passed on intact, so I think it, it sounds like Don Fung didn't even do something that bad. He just made it so that dragons wouldn't, or like, I, I guess he ended the dragon bloodline, maybe? Dragon transmutation. Like, new people can't become dragons anymore or something. I don't know. It is as I said. Same face-off as earlier. Stand so different from one another. Don Fung is no more. Now, there is only Don Hung. Next will be Don Young. You. I am the general of the Lofu. There are things that I wish I did not have to do. Uh huh. And yet I must. I see. Smiles. <laughs> Let us talk of happier tidings. The friends you made on the express are here. <laughs> Do you wish to see them? <laughs> I'd, I'd find it hard. This guy's like all business and suddenly he's like, yeah, by the way, I'm your friendly grandpa. <laughs> you, you brought them here? <laughs> yes. Whoa. They are waiting in the Dragon Vista Rain Hall. Whoa. Go. Your friends are waiting for you. Sorry, I'm busy. Blast fishing. <laughs> I, I don't know, guys. I can't even use my E. Sad. Can't use technique. There's somewhat of a secret technique, if you will. I have been keeping careful watch against the abominations of abundance. Uh huh. The Stellaron hunters. And the disciples of Sanctus Medicus. I see. But I never anticipated the antimatter legion. Yeah. The hunt is far from over. Yet all the while we find ourselves at war with other evil spirits. Hmm. <sighs> From this battle onward, the Alliance must fight the Legion to our dying breath. Uh-huh. Even if it means the end of the Law Fu. Sure. This would mean that the evil one wins, though. The evil girl <laughs> that made Ting snap her neck. There's more ghosts here, too. Our intelligence tells us that the Legion are a mad and destructive war machine. Yeah. Yet they never took up arms against the Alliance. I see. The armies of the Seven Ravagers all have their own means of destruction. Right. They are not to be taken lightly. I'm gonna have to have someone recap all of this for me at one point, because my brain is exploding. Lord Ravager Fantilia favors internal collapse. Right. Which is why she masterminded the Stellaron Crisis and urged the disciples of Sanctus Medicus out of the shadow. I see. Now that her plot has been laid bare, she has no choice but to retreat. Yeah. Yet that hardly suits her philosophy of destruction. There must be something more. I was gonna say, I really don't think fully retreating is gonna be the play. It's probably it's probably gonna be that character from the from the launcher, not gonna lie. 
So this person is one of the seven. I'm, I'm, I might be getting this wrong. I think this one is one of the seven and they all control the antimatter legion. Is that right? Hello. We, who? Are you guys all dragonborns? Dovakin? Wait, Dovakin just means dragon kind, doesn't it? Dragon kin. Maybe. Uh huh. Roiling Deep. Fontaine. Uh huh. And bestowed us with the permanence of the Vidyatara. I see. Thanks for the lore, dude. I'm I make little flowers. Flower. <laughs> Flower. <laughs> Do you know something? Many when things. Don Fong committed his great crime. Yeah. The Ten Lords Commission advocated strongly for him to be destroyed. Mm hmm The Vidyatara, on the other hand. We're split evenly in their favor and disfavor of the motion. I see. <laughs> the dragon transmutation inheritance was not intact after all. Mm -hmm. The senior Vidyadra hated you, yet did not dare to kill you. I see. The Vidyadra were under great pressure. In order to placate the Ten Lords and Skyfaring Commissions, they performed an exuviation charm on Don Fong against his will. Still, I'm trying to think of what he's saying. They ensured that the charm contained a flaw, thinking that this would fool the Ten Lords Commission. <laughs> the senior <laughs> Vidyatara <laughs> were sure of their scheme, but you cannot hide fire with paper. Well, if it's like layers, you can. That's maybe what they've done. You haven't thought of that, have you? Don Hong Circle, Imbibit of Lune. Hello. Mm-hmm. That's so OP though. That's actually broken. I'm gonna walk around. Anything else around here? I guess I'm not allowed there. Alright. Wow, I mean I I need a breather, honestly. So much stuff is happening. None of it's making real sense. Sustenance anchor. Recover. 78. Hell yeah. I'm not yet 80. Hey, gang, look at this me! I'm there! I can't look, believe it. Your friends are taking the fight to the Legion as we speak. Yeah, they're really fighting right there. We need to help them. Let's go! It does still say Don Hong. Okay, let's talk. Look at us! What a cool gang out here. Oh, did I? Heaven search. I'll use it three times. This is probably gonna do a million damage yes. then, no? That seems incredibly broken, you know? <laughs> oh wait, I'm broken too. Man, I want physical MC again, kinda. I liked her way more than fire MC. I just pressed it three times. Uh, maybe... Why does he look so broken, man? <laughs> oh, he looks incredibly OP. Yo, March, 712 damage, that's crazy. Oh my god, when are we gonna get March Prime? Oh! I'm waiting for that now. March is also a goddess. Oh, she's gonna be so cool. I'm sorry, but Daniel's broken. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, no crit. Never lucky. I guess we never get to see his burst. It's just locked. We're probably gonna need it for the final fight. I assume, anyway. Ah, oh, you can, like, charge it a different amount of times and it still costs the same amount of skill points. Okay, I'll check that out in a second here. Because that's interesting. Let's try one. I think I did three and... I did three and two. This is one. Let's make it quick. That's cool. There's He's an no interesting character. Don't punch my boy. Don't punch my girl. Okay, so one, two, three. I feel like his skill points just, like, they're not costing anything. That's really interesting. I think he's gonna be broken. Kafka stood no chance in comparison. <laughs> Kafka's not as good. But I just wanted Kafka because, you know, it's Kafka. Yeah, you can see the icon change as well. Okay, so three skill points, it makes sense that it does that much damage then. Kinda. Where have you been? Dealing with the enemies, little one. 
<laughs> Forgive my late arrival, Lady, Lady Fu. Fu. I love that. We are indebted to you and your forces. <laughs> the seat he of says that shit all the time. Relate the battle reports to me. As for Fantilia's plan, he just he honestly just bargains with services and debts, but like actions, not money. The Ambrosial Arbor, that's her focus. Uh huh. Lord Ravager Fantilia's strategy was to create civil strife, then let it consume the Sien Joe from within. He knew. <laughs> to disseminate the power of the plague's author. He knew. And turn the Lafu into a hell of undying abominations. Yeah. Hmm. That is clear to me now. Friends of the Astral Express. We just I fought together. Someone with me whom I think you'll be eager to see. Wow, thank you so much. It's all your work. Roar. Uh-huh. <laughs> Is that Don, huh? <laughs> you have horns. You are Don Hung, right? He's cosplaying. What's with the horns? Just cosplaying, man. Come on. It's a long story, March. <laughs> it's me. So you do have secret strength. <laughs> I wonder if well, I think Wells and Himeko knew. I think. <laughs> Let us save such reminiscence for later, shall we? So you're gonna make a, you're an awful person, you know? My astral guess. When you first appeared on the La Fool. Your stated aim was the resolution of the Stellaron crisis. Mm -hmm. I was concerned that the Stellaron hunters harbored ulterior motives and refused your offer. I see. I see now that I was overly anxious. You can trust Kafka when it comes to me. I don't know why, but we'll learn at some point, I'm sure. Nevertheless, it is true that the motives of the Stellaron hunters were not what they appeared. Yeah. <laughs> In My cape is that glitching the Express out. And the Sienjo fight side by side. Kafka lured you here and broadened the scope of the crisis. Mm -hmm. In doing so, she succeeded in making it clear that your sincerity is beyond doubt. I know. The Lafu is in your debt. That was her goal. And I have no right to seek further assistance from her. That was her goal. However, as Lady Fu has explained, the appearance of Fantilia means that the situation is far from under our control. Uh-huh. As general of the Law Fu, it would be foolish of me not to ask Don Hong and the hey. rest of you for your strength at this critical moment. So he is Don Hong and not Fong to you anymore. Okay, Even cool. If the crisis on the Law Fu had so he's not to surprised. Do with the Stellaron, I would be willing to help. But I can't speak for the other members of my crew. That's very honorable, Mr. Welt. Explore understand establish and connect as the crew of the express that's the trailblaze creed we follow i like that still when the journey gets tough those words can feel far off i love this shot it's so hard it actually goes so hard fear risk enemies and death are the obstacles i can't die it's fine <laughs> i can't <laughs> die that's why the nameless who are able to stay the course number few indeed uh-huh whether our destination lies before us or behind us, the decision is ours to make. Mm -hmm. Here, as on the express, every vote counts. I love this. It's so honorable. I live for it. I'm voting for, obviously. I know we all are. Ooh. Don Hung? Daniel? He's gonna vote. Hold out hand? Remain still. Me? Me as Daniel? I don't want to pick as Daniel. That's unfair. I only pick as me. This is the, <laughs> this goes against the code of the Astro Express. Remain still? Hold out hand. I don't know. What would Dan do? Dan would help his friends. Sure. Thank you, Don Hong. <laughs> <laughs> How am I still one of the nameless? I stand here at the mercy of others without true freedom to speak. Okay. But as a descendant of the Vidyadara, I will fulfill my duty to the Law Fu. I see. <laughs> Great! <laughs> heroic is when they arrived. So, what's the master plan, I love plan, March, General? man. <laughs> there is no master plan. Only a bet. Gamba. 
A bet on the senior Vidyadra's incomplete exuviation charm. And on Dong Hong's ability to access the memories of the High Elder. Alright. High Elder? It's a long story, March. Even I don't get it. And I've heard all of it. <laughs> I get I get it. A little bit. When the rainbow wow. Hello. Arbor, remnants of the curse of the plague's author lingered. Cool shot. In order to make the stemming of those Very medieval. a possibility, the Law Fu invoked the power of the Scions of Permanence. Mm -hmm. Under the direction of the High Elder, the Vidyadara guided the waters of the ancient sea to flood the Scale Gorge waterscape delve. That's cool. And contain the arbor to commemorate this magnificent feat and mm -hmm. sacrifice. The Alliance erected the Dragon Vista Rain Monument. A Vidyadara statue. That's cool. Oh, it looks so much like Don Hong. I wonder if... It was Don Fong. What do you wonder? The statue. Is that... Don Hong's brother? <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I see why you might think so. Yes. These events occurred a long time ago. Yet successive generations of High Elders have not differed greatly in their appearance. Mm -hmm. That is, until the current generation. The most recent successor did not inherit the same level of power. I see. And their appearance is that of a child. Wait. Is it? Her? Do you understand, Don Hong? Since Dong Fong perished. Yeah. The Law Fu Vidyadra have no longer had an individual capable of performing such Is Don feats. Fung gonna leave us? But you, who once kept watch over the arbor, should be able to open a way through to that great tree. I hear singing already, it's emo moments. What happens next is in your Go! Hands. Go! I'm telling you. Open the road. Talk to the others. I mean, I want to talk to everybody. Of course, of course. You know, there's gonna be a long time still. Hey, dude. Has coming here triggered your memory? Yes. Release your full potential. The power you carry is the key to opening a way through to the Ambrosial Arbor. That's wild. That's wild. Why am I staring at a ball? So, so is Welt. I knew you'd come. Welt Fung. When we first mentioned the Sienjo, there was a sad look in your eyes. <laughs> they may have banished you, but the Lawfu is still your home. Yeah. Thanks for your help. I'm sorry I never spoke up. What? I, th I guess thanks for the help. You're a member of the Express Crew, Don Hung. Damn, we'll Welt. this matter as soon as possible. What a champ. Our journey doesn't end here. Yeah. Damn, I, uh, how the hell will this game even end? Everyone's gonna die. <laughs> this is so weird. I look at me as you both become silent. This is this will be wild. If she speaks, like if I speak... Shakes her head, doesn't want to speak. Nobody can get her to open up. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. I'm just standing there silently. Say something. Look, look at me just kind of side-eyeing. It's like we never knew each other, Daniel. <laughs> it's so cool that your character just stands there. I'm just there. Look at her. She's just looking into the void. That's wild. Early May's reincarnation. Dong Hong, correct? Mm-hmm. I've heard your name before. Have you? How can that be? My name was erased. Why would the names the banished be recorded? Your name was only erased from the public eye. Of course. But as the master diviner, I know, and should know, <laughs> all the records of years gone by. Sure. Such archives are of great importance in times of need. Massive head. I was not born in the heroic and extraordinary era of the High Cloud Quintet. Quintets. To have seen those legends with my own eyes. Mm-hmm. Go on. Your appearance closely matches the depiction in the annals. Mm-hmm. Does Vidyadara reincarnation really entail a complete transformation? A new life? I don't know. 
I'm not gonna answer either. You don't deserve my answer. How about you? You got something to say? Still has important matters to discuss with you. Oh. Please remain here. I just wanted to have a chat with you, bro. I care about you too. All right, March. How do you feel about this? Uh, you scared the heck out of me. <laughs> For a second, I thought you'd annoyed the general. It seemed like you were his prisoner. Uh huh. There I was thinking up a plan to kidnap you. <laughs> and it turns out the two of you are old buddies. Yeah, buddies. So, what made you suddenly decide to come down from the express? Um, this is cute. He wouldn't say this, but I'm gonna. Aww, how sweet. <laughs> but, Mr. Yang and I have been holding our own. She didn't even mention me. We're pretty much Sienjo heroes at this point. <laughs> anyway, it's great to have you with us, Don Hung. Sweet. Cute. Alright. Let's do this, as the music is going to peak. Statue of the High Elder has been greatly changed by the years of weathering, but there are still small words engraved near its base. I don't know how to pronounce this. Hearken, as Arbor revives and foe nears, we call forth the mighty waters of ancient sea to flood abodes of heaven and quell roots of evil. We etch this in stone for all to heed. Try to feel the greater power. Let me get an epic screenshot, though. Beneath the endless rolling waves, the ancient roots the arbor blaze, long dormant, they stir and come to life, as if a beast were talking from its strife. The containment mechanisms woven by past thrones, the bindings that tame the beast's power known, a fragile net, soon to shatter and fall, its decay a warning, heard by one and all. Memories from past emerge from the darkness, tightly gripping you. Okay. <laughs> okay. Whoa, what the hell? This looks so HD. That's weird. I like it. Holy shit, it's Moses. <laughs> He's splitting the sea. It's so unusual, this choice of music for these scenes. But it's really cool. Wow. We've unlocked Watatsumi. That's crazy. I'm sorry, but that's crazy. I'm sorry, but... The Imbibiter Lune arrives, you know? I'm sorry, but there's dolphins floating around and shit, dude. The annals mention that Scale Gorge Waterscape was once the location of Dragon Palace. Mm-hmm. Small wonder. Look at all these submerged structures. I know. I was fortunate enough to be here during the Shuhu upheaval period. Dude, no way. I witnessed this place in its prime. This looks amazing. The palace was left in ruins, and the Vidyadra used their sacred homeland to imprison the arbor. Mm -hmm. The Lofu and the Sienjo are greatly indebted to them. You have a lot of depths. <laughs> you have a lot of depths. <laughs> Lady Fu. Lady Fu. Here, General. Do you know your brother, Kung? <laughs> I'm sorry. Um. Remain here. Yes. Get the Cloud Knights in defense of this passage. We must prevent further incidents. But this is crazy because it's not the end yet. Jing Yuan, General, are you planning to face Gantilia alone? Whoa. Nah, dude. <laughs> I wouldn't say so. That's cute. I'll be counting on a few friends for support. That's cute. I got General, your back, brother. Don't cast us aside. We're willing to go with you. My mans. Yes, General. We may not be the mightiest force, but it's our duty as Cloud Knights to protect the Sienjo. I respect the How confidence, bros. Face the danger while we stay behind the lines. With your permission, sir, allow me to lead the way. <laughs> I understand your sentiments, soldiers. Just stay here, man. But the adversary ahead of us is not an abomination of abundance. They are a Lord Ravager of the Antimatter wow. Legion. Crossing this line will bring you into the conflict between the Rainbow Arbiter and the Ruin Author. That's insane. You have a more important duty. Cloud Knights, attention! <laughs> I love this. I, I remember, I think it was in Simulated Universe, maybe, they talked about this. They're like, it's, oh no, it was Kafka that told us, right? In the last act, where 
it's only i'm sorry i don't remember what they're actually called but like archons can take out other archons that's one of the main ways just like war between them and this is one of those essentially although i don't know if the seven mean guys i hope i'm getting it right the seven antimatter legion commanders basically i think that's what's what's happening and they're fighting although lan is also just a god this has nothing to do with the antimatter does it i don't know help me out please <laughs> please explain to me <laughs> after i enter the ambrosial arbor and if the seawater returns to its original state yeah you must withdraw immediately and seal off the delve once more uh oh the master diviner will lead you okay yes general Yes, sir. Nod. Lady Fu, if I am unable to return, I entrust you with the important task of relaying the full account to the other Sienjo ships. Wow. I trust you will be here to reissue the order in person. But whatever the outcome, <laughs> I will do as you command and honor the mission. I like her a lot as well. <laughs> Spoken like a true general. That's so cute. That's so cute. All right, gang. Roll out. Items obtained. Level 64. Sanctus Medicus Darani. As I slowly walk down the stairs. In a scenic matter. And dragons swim by. Holy shit, that looks cool. Whoa, what the hell. Wow, these steps are so far apart. Oh my god. Gotta find a way down. What do you mean so far apart? Oh. Or you walk on the tree, man. Come on. We're adventurers, you should know this. This place looks beautiful. I ruined the immersion once more. Let's go with like an actual safe team. <laughs> I know, I think they're gonna force me to go with myself in the team as well, but whatever. This is, uh, this works. I'm the general. It's kind of canon. This place is beautiful. Treason. Blasphemy. Yes. Those who are not of our kind can never be of our mind. Hey, why is everyone so racist, man? I understand your misgivings, but my decision is made. That is the course we must take. Is that Don Fong? I... Very well. In that case, I will report you to the preceptors and have you stripped of the name and power of the High Elder. Kill him. This must be... The first High Elder that accepted the mission to quell the Ambrosial Arbor. So, one of the things was, I think... Uh, King said, like, that mm, it was the same line that was the High Elder for a while now. My question is, does that mean reincarnations of Don Hung were it? Or were there just different, like, completely different dragon kin before that? Or the leaders. I don't know. It's too confusing to me. Commentating and thinking about all this on, and making hilarious jokes like Kung Fu is too much. They would guide the tides of the ancient sea to guard and strengthen the arbor seal. Mm -hmm. Do you remember now? No. Re re refresh my memory, please. Yes. Reverence to the three talents, the path to the great roots. It's the way to the root depths. Uh-huh. Uh, is that some kind of riddle? Reverence to the three talons. A three-headed dragon. What does that mean? No one knows. Don't worry about it. Just follow me. Follow me, dude. Oh, what a huge palace. Those three talons. Completely abandoned. Boom. That must have been I'm breaking ancient that. artifacts. Imagine how upset you'd be if you had to abandon me. That would be so upsetting. For the Vidyatara, it must have been a necessary sacrifice. Hey, Anchor. Nice. Dude. I'm not over how pretty this place is. It's incredibly cool to walk around here. Remove three Vidyatara seals. Okay, so the mechanic is ceremonial lamp. Mm -hmm. uh, lighting them up in a specific sequence. Alright. This is one of the places mentioned in the riddle. Sure. One of the three talents. Yeah. If we can break the seal here, we'll be a step closer to the roots of the arbor. I'll light them. Hey, check it out. The bases of these stone lanterns are different. Oh, wow. <laughs> One, got it. Two. This is a very difficult problem to solve. 
I don't know if you figured it out yet. I think I have, though. Very difficult puzzle. But, you know, if you're a dragonkin um, and have studied for many, many years, you might be able to break the seal. It's a really difficult one. I understand if you don't get it. We lit the first few pillars. It worked. Yep, I know. Shadow, I used my massive brain. You hear about Miss Tinyun? I want to hear I this. Received word from Lady Fu. The depth of Fentilia's infiltration. Yeah. Along with her meticulous planning. Uh huh. Makes her extremely difficult to guard against. Uh, we were trying to get some pity talks the for Tinyun mostly. Carry out an investigation. But for now, our most pressing matter is to put a stop to Fentilia's scheme. Yeah. Fair enough. You don't see me. Haha, <laughs> you actually don't, blind ass. He's like, hey, where'd he go? Run. Run. Haha, <laughs> you suck. Hello there. If your people knew that you had brought me here, yeah. it would be great unrest. They will never know. <laughs> Keep quiet, Yingxing. Yingxing. This will make us even. I will give you two hours. Wow. Research what you can. Remember, two hours. This high elder does not seem like a bad person. Do you think two hours isn't enough? It will be done. Hmm. Hmm. That's Dan Fung's voice. Oh. But what about the other person? It's so familiar. Was it like? I don't know, man. <laughs> I, want, I want to give a guess. I would have said some descendant, probably the leader of like the previous, like before Jing Yun or something, or nah. I'd, I'd say like the old general or something like that. Run, got pace, big pace. was already on the verge of breaking before the Ambrosial Arbor's resurrection. <laughs> yes. Um, let me touch one. What seems to be the problem, Frank? Hmm. It would appear the seals have you at a loss. Stop! They don't. Could the murals in our vicinity be related to the seals? Stop! You're spoiling! Stop! I was I was figuring it out myself. I was starting with counting the amount of people there. It makes the most sense that the baby is number one, or is this the rebirth? So this would be the last one. The birth of a baby. Is there an actual explanation? Beneath the lunar glow. Oh. The diadora eggs begin to form, and from the ancient sea rebirth. To walk again on solid earth. They were poets as well. This mural describes the Vidyadara hatching rebirth in the lunar recent depths. Mm -hmm. the, the beginning of self reincarnation. I see. This I got that far. This mural is pretty interesting. It looks like time hasn't had any effect on it. Well, there's a couple scratches. This mural must be related to the others here. Mm -hmm. It tells the story of the Vidyadara self reincarnation from hatching rebirth in the ancient sea. Yeah. To the return to that same sea as the cycle begins again. Mm -hmm. Hey, do you think this could be related to the seal? <laughs> Shocker. Shocker of a. Perhaps? Oh, fair enough. It's tough racking your brains all the time. <laughs> I'm struggling to keep track. I kind of get it, March. I'm a dummy as well in this one. Not gonna lie. Alright. Um, I think, uh. Hmm. He's making soup, and they're going to war. This is them being educated, I think. I don't know, what is this scene? Tell me, Don. Oh. And as the day is almost <laughs> gone, standing by myself. return alone to water's song. Beneath the this waves is the end and end. Shell, await new life that time will tell. Yeah. The worldly limit of the Vidyadra is reached after seven centuries. Okay. And they return to the ancient sea and form a shell. Awaiting the next hatching rebirth. Mm -hmm. That's definitely the last one then. I think this is them being educated, and that's probably them fighting. And then I think this is next, and then that one. We'll see. Our reincarnation's greatest cost. Yeah. The wisdom of a past life lost. Mm -hmm. Yet through the teachings of our kind, unto the young again consigned. Figured. The world depicts the Vidyadara being guided by their elder. I know. A wiser kin after their rebirth. Of course. Easy number two. Easy number two. I think this is just them fighting for their life until they're old. Our people sing the hymn of clouds. Mm hmm And dance to waters cherished sounds. And how life goes, you know. The dragon flies. To each is destined different skies. Yeah. 
This depicts people going their own way in life. The hero portrays the Vidyadara young. They acquire knowledge and depart for different places on yeah. Shenzhou, thereby dedicating themselves to serving the Alliance. Uh huh. Definitely part three. Punk. And followed by finally. Death. Cool. Punk. Oh, I did. <laughs> I did a weird order. Okay. Let's head to the third seal. On it, on it, Chief, Chief, Chiefington. Sorry, coming through. I'm not fighting any of these antimatter numbnuts. There's no need. There's no need. Oh, there is a need. <laughs> Run, Diagro already. I collected the Pearl Keeper's communication, Stella. This monument was erected at the bottom of the lunar and depths for the Pearl Keepers to leave messages during the underwater investigation. Unauthorized contact is strictly forbidden. Pretty sure that it's actually going to talk about letting that guy script something or like rewrite script in two hours. What is this? These are our little dragon boys Miss and March, girls. I would advise you to refrain from interfering with the Vidyadara. Tap it. Uh huh. The Vidyadara? <laughs> mm-hmm. You mean these pearls will turn into people? Yes. When the life of a Vidyadara is over. They return to the ancient sea Knock on it. Michelle before emerging anew. This is the hatching rebirth cycle. Cool. Whoa. You can see the scales as well. Tap it. Hey, wake up. <laughs> Level 80. You? Oh, you're a formidable enemy. Formidable foe. Hello. That should do, General. Oh. Enough. Oh. Okay. This is of vital importance to the Ambrosial Arbor Seal. Safety must be guaranteed. Is this a young Ching Yuan? Quelling the Arbor is the duty of the Vidyadara. Mm hmm. Keep in mind, this generation cannot afford to oh. the failure of the previous High Elder. <laughs> of course. The Cloud Knight General Rough. and the Ten Lords Commission. They performed regular inspections of Scale Gorge Waterscape. Uh huh. Okay. I commend. I'm with you. I'm buffing myself up. It's coming up, guys. More. Glimmer Crystal Clear for the R egg catches your eye. Sure does. Careless. Oh, you caress a shell slowly as a motherly affection. Remember that you're responsible for watching the video R egg in Scale Gorge Waterscape as a member of the Pearl Keeper team. Although you're not very well versed in the Cloud Hymn and not physically trained in combat, it's going too quick. Vidar Egg, when you're in patrol, your teammates recognize your motherly love towards the egg. You bet your job comes to an end when a monster covered in leaves bar barges into the b b clumsily spear fight the monsters. You cry over the broken eggshells and your blood pours out non-stop like your tears. Aw, oh, no way, what the hell? They just recount a really sad story with a couple lines that scroll by very quick. Oh, lordy. The last of the three talents is here. I see it. There are abominations up ahead. Careful, everyone. Abundance, Sprite, Malefic Ape. It's a monkey! It's a monkey! It's a little monkey. I need wind. There's you're not weak to anything I have. Courage. Boom. Good luck, monkey. Monkey, strong. Time gusto! Dolce gusto. But what if I freeze you though? You're lucky. You're a lucky monkey. I think I'm gonna have to defeat the wolves as well, but it'll be it'll be a piece of cake, I feel. Boom. So close. There we go, monkey gone. There we go. Whew. Did you notice the flagstone the creature was stepping on? Yeah. I wonder if it has any connection to the seal. Thanks for the hint. Items obtained. A revelation slate. Special stone slate. Left by the Vidavidavidavida. Seems to be uh, information about certain sequence hidden in its markings. I mean, it depends. How do we look at this? So there's a hole somewhere. In these. It would be on this side. R. Okay, it shows me the thing every time. So if the hole is there, it's placed like this. So this is the first one. Got it. Huge. Then bottom left. But the top one of the two. Do -do -do -do. Nope, not what I meant to do. There we go. A nice little addition. And finally, bottom right. I think only has one, right? So can't have this one be wrong. Boom. There we go. 
The last flames are lit. Is the bridge going to rebuild itself? What happens? A whole lot of nothing. So, oh, <laughs> there it is. Perfect fit. Wow. Looks extremely safe. And like something I would like to walk on. The reverence to the three talons is complete. Now we must head for the roots of the arbor. I agree. The roots of the arbor are still growing. Yes. It's Ventilia. We must hurry. I'm running. <laughs> I'm sprinting as quick as I can. I'm hurrying, I promise. I mean, okay, I said that the other thing looked as boss fighty as it got. This looks as boss fighty as it gets. Although that other place also looked pretty boss fighty. It was just the entrance to this place. Let's heal up. Um, I had QQ. I mean, I think wind would be... It makes sense if there's a wind weakness and a fire weakness. Because <laughs> it's MC. And Daniel? There's probably not going to be a physical weakness. We'll go in it with this. Whatever. It'll probably be a long fight. It's fine. We must hurry as we take our time. Is this the first time you've noticed it? There's also a dragon right here. We've reached the end. These are the roots of the Ambrosial Arbor, mm -hmm. where the vestiges of abundance lie. Mm -hmm. Reverence to the three talents, the path to the great roots. This is it. Under the power of the High Elder, the Arbor's roots have formed into the image of a dragon. Mm -hmm. Now. I will break the final seal. There's more. I hope everyone is prepared. Oh, you know what? Actually, I forgot to have breakfast. Let's camp. I guess there's much to say. We can nod and move on. A dragon gallant. It's ocean distant. Step into the depths of the roots of the arbor. That's insane. Look at it. What just expired? <laughs> something expired. Maybe I missed out on some lore or some. Yo, you can't work the camera here. Fair enough. Whoa. Look at this. If King is knocked down, the battle will immediately end. He's not allowed to die. Enter the birthplace of Xian Shou's long life species and destroy the Lord Ravager's Fantelius plot. So, Electro, Wind, and... This is interesting. Must include King. So, we have a Trial King. How are his, st his stats? 60, 77? I think this is way better than mine. <laughs> 40? I mean... I mean, let's see. 1.7k attack? Yeah, we'll go with the Trial one. We'll go with the Trial one. So, we'll go Gep. We'll go Nat. We'll go... I think this Lo Yukong over here and then finally the trial king we don't have any wind it's okay cutscene moment this was loaded up that's crazy that's crazy i love the hand maybe it's a little preloaded cutscene oh walking on clouds another lotus flower No. Has the general of the law food chosen to grace me with his presence? You have a way too smooth and nice voice to be evil. Ah, that witch! That she bitch! She was here waiting for us the whole time! <laughs> Show yourself, Fantilia! Show yourself! And the benefactors, too! Yes. Oh, patience, patience. Uh, let me make myself presentable. Please. Don't take the now shape of Tingyun or something. The Arbor's traces really do possess the power of metamorphosis and resurrection. Uh-huh. All of you ready yourselves. <laughs> Don Hong, guard my back. I'm counting on you. I'm with you. I am counting Understood. on you. Damn, <laughs> damn. He's sprinting up. He's like, I won't let you transform, wench. <laughs> Fantilia, what is she doing? Uh, I don't know. What do you want me to say? She's preparing a cutscene. Uh... Whoa, God. She's huge. It was merely her hat. <laughs> What the hell? Oh, we're fighting. That was she didn't even say a word. Hello. Benefactors, behold 
I hate when she calls us that, no, it just reminds me of Ting Yun. The miracles of abundance live up to the name. I see. Let's see if I can put it to good use. Okay, you also have two little spawns. <laughs> she just flakes! <laughs> nah, you a bitch. Alright. Uh, good thing we went with, uh... Yeah, she really has. Focus on destroying the phantom flowers. I'll go for the body. Hey, you know what? Funnily enough, I brought her for that. That's what I was gonna say. I'm glad I brought you Kong. Nat's nah, just here for good vibes. So is Gep. <laughs> He's punching her in the chest, man. <laughs> so much bark with so little bite. Your attacks are futile. I'll punch you in the boob again. Careful. <laughs> Are you a spirit? I don't understand. She keeps having just different bodies. Stop flicking me like I'm a little bit of snot or something. Vanquish the abomination. Vanquish the abomination. The wind is rising. Yeah, just get the flower. It may be a waste. Should probably punch her, but we didn't crit. It was perfect. Skill point recovered. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna shield up just in case she actually starts doing damage. She has three phases, it's gonna be a while. Can I press Z? Will it actually, like, give me some stats? Weaving roots, I hate the roots, man. It's back to the stupid deer thing. <laughs> wow, I've never heard him be so toxic. Look at this shot, it's so crazy. Frozen res, entanglement res. Wind damage to a single target, minor wind damage to all targets, wind damage to a single target and delays their action, or summons Abundance Lotus. The body born out of the Ambrosial Amber by Fantalia. Fantalia, I don't know how to pronounce it. Lord Ravager of the Antimatter Legion. This flesh possesses the power of both destruction and abundance, a form that embodies the cycle of death and rebirth. It is also the first fruit born from the rejuvenated Ambrosial Arbor. I see. I see. Interesting, as you might say. Show no mercy. I'm trying to show no mercy, but, you know, I'm intrigued. That's awful, actually. King moved right before her. Bad order. Naughty child. <laughs> That's what you'd call a god. Naughty child. Skill points reduced. Leave me alone. King's actually just bopping the flowers without any effort. Hey! Stop stealing! Theft is bad. Just like you did identity theft, you're awful. On my command. On my command. I wonder what she's gonna be like when she's shield broken. We haven't hit it yet. Stop spawning flowers! <laughs> Bitch. Die. I should've eat. Will I get all my skill points back? I wonder. Shield up again. I'm going no heals. I'm going flat shoes. Okay, I won't say that. Phase 3, I'm definitely going heals. Hope you're prepared. I mean, I guess skill point reduced. It doesn't. No, I meant to switch. It's okay. It's perfect, actually. Nice play, Ting Yun. Not Ting Yun. I keep, miss I keep calling the wrong one wrong one. Oh, she's like out of breath. I always say Ting Yun instead of. And I just completely forgot her name. <laughs> A nice little bit of damage. Now King moves next, so it's worth it. Stop flicking me. Until your scheme ends here. I love that they have special voice lines for this. Samsara. That's what they call that move, Samsara. There's so many references. Ow, oh, okay, you know what? I, I lied. I am healing. Boonk. Tense. Tense, but nice. A new weekly will be unlocked after this intense fight. Eee! That looks crazy! What the hell? Full on frozen like that? Stop some sorrowing me. So she isn't frozen resist. Oh, or she isn't freeze resistance. 
Vanquish the Abomination. It just gave all my skill points back every time. 4%, 2%. These flowers are mad annoying and they spawn really quick too. I think I'm just gonna ignore them. Find something, I don't know what you said. The vanguard of the hunt to victory. I'm the vanguard of the hunt. Whoa, whoa! Whoa! Okay, now she's destruction phase, so she'll do a lot of damage. And with it, the abundance and the hunt will disappear. Nah, that's not how it works. The hunt's the most fun, you can't do that. Okay, so we can't get rid of that. Unfortunately, no skill points. Kind of a shame. Ow! Bro, I, my shield useless. She just took a bite out of me. Listen, I know I'm a snack, but that's not how I want to that's not how I want to be treated. You take it from here. Oh. Oh. Yo. Yo. Deal massive imaginary damage to all enemies. All right. All right. I thought Daniel would actually swap in here. That would have been wild. Oh, a scion of this is crazy. Have you finally remembered your duty of watching over the arbor? Only when necessary. On my command. On my command. Watch this though. Bang. And you think you're cool right now, don't you? Watch this crit. 20k damage. Just like that. Oh. Oh. I love when you say something stupid and it actually works one time. The music is banger as well though. 15k, he's getting buffed the longer the fight goes. Uh oh. Uh oh, here we go with this again. <laughs> here we go with this again. We can't let King die, don't, don't forget. If he dies, the mission fails. And we will not get them next time. The game ends, I have to make a new account. Die. I'm glad I can't punch the flowers, though. That helps a lot. Vanguard of the hunt. Ow. Ah. Wait, you can use this spell, so my Nat E would just fix this? Oh. That's good to know. Till your scheme ends here. Yeah, he'll get, but let's see. He does cleanse a little bit. Don Hung! <laughs> Yo, he's so broken, man. He's so broken. Quit flicking her, she's like the least flickable for me. Are we? Uh-huh. He's talking so much shit! Uh-oh. You've pissed her off now. Wow. I can't- I can actually can't wait to be queen with them. Holy moly! Peace. Peace and friendship. Shield up. My young boy from Bellabog will save me. Summon a lightning lord and eliminate the flowers by gener uh, generated by Fentale. Yeah, of course. I mean, I've, I've been doing this. Look at her! What if we do this now? She is so- this is so cool, man. It's actually so cool. She looks incredible. It's a real shame she's evil. Die. Skill point recovered. Skill point recovered. Uh, I'm gonna stack up my shield, because I'm scared. Vanguard of two victory. Um, I'm just gonna normal punch. Use a little- little three- little burst. Because... I know that the next two turns aren't damage dealers. Gonna cleanse that. He's fine. He's a tanky boy. She is so cool. She is so cool. Spirit never dies. Now that's a cool ass line for this fight. I'm gonna shield up again. I don't think I had to. I think my shield is still pretty healthy, but better safe than sorry. Stop killing her. Stop it. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's fine. <laughs> he gets crushed by a goddess in between two flowers. Is that all? Hello. 
It's like I'm fighting some rando. <laughs> he did not even shrug. Alright, this is big. Having burst here is big. Big time. Big time damage. Hey, it didn't kill the things. This will, though. I'm never lucky. I'm actually never lucky. Give me my skill points. Yeah, that's right. Hey! <laughs> I just got those back. Wench? <laughs> I'm scared. Oh. Uh, it's okay. We good. He also says, was that it? My guy's just toxic. I'm fine. I'm cool. I'm aight with it. Can I cleanse that? Oh, I can just do this. Daniel, I need your assistance. Thank you, Daniel. Boom. Skill points back. I kind of want to kill that flower real bad, honestly. Um, let's heal this low health a little bit. I'm then going to buff myself in three. We're going to crit, because we're always lucky. Yukong is especially good against pretty girls. Never mind. <laughs> it doesn't work. Let's hit this. Your ski men's here. here. Entered repose. Currently in repose. Okay, so it's rest. It's good for us. <laughs> he doesn't care. Gep doesn't care. Fantilia. Kill this. I should. I shouldn't focus it. It was gonna die from AOE. I love it. Amazing music. Repose has ended. Alright, well then I start my shield. Currently in repose once more. This might kill. 2%. Is my Nats gonna get the last hit? I feel like it's fitting if it's if it's Ching Yuan, actually. Uh-huh. She's using so many moves. Right, 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 right. Mm-hmm. When I hear Nanook, it just reminds me of Tom Nook, and then I'm not that scared anymore. Oh, I tanked this. He's alive too. Gep shield diff. Alright, hit us with it. Daniel's gonna help too, though. Oh no, he's T-posing. You're unleashing his maximum power. Daniel? I wonder if the transformation of a Sienger general into a void ranger would cast the law Fu back into chaos. No, it's fine. Fu is there anyway. This was all part of the plan, my lady. Kafka or something. Is it? <laughs> Did he just solo her? <laughs> He's just stronger than it? That's badass. Do it! Yeet. Milady. Catch him. Nah, you didn't die. Stop faking this death baloney. There's- he isn't dead. Hey, he did catch him. Not My kings. Yeah, fair enough. And you. How much, longer can you last? much longer. He has the friends now. Is nah, dude. Be gone. Thought. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that works too. We're coming for them. Yes, my king! Let's fucking go, man. I love the hunt anyway. My favorite tree. <laughs> well, I don't know if this is what I'd start by saying, but I guess it makes sense. What do you want him to re respond? I'm still alive. No. Yeah. That's, that's, that's a point. And it would seem the two of us can still coordinate our efforts. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs>
I love it. Venturia, a truly fearsome enemy. Mm -hmm. If she hadn't attempted to turn me into a pawn of destruction, I'm afraid victory would have been far from certain. Well, we had her on the ropes. Fantilia had established a link between me and herself. Uh huh. Her well timed strike gravely injured her. Thus, her connection to the arbor was severed. Injured her? Though? So it was all part of the plan? When Don Hung stabbed you, I was scared to death. Uh huh. Is she still alive? Yes. Is that thing dead? <laughs> no. Yeah, she said it. She was using like a pawn. It takes more than that to destroy an emanator of destruction. In other words, Still. we've made no progress today whatsoever. <laughs> Fantilia won't be stirring up trouble anytime soon. Uh huh. Don't worry about her infecting the arbor again. It's just that sealing the Stellaron is going to take some time. Hmm. Leave that to the Master Diviner. Whew. I'm afraid I may <laughs> He's be. He's just yawning. Somewhat spent. Yeah, deserved. Tingyun also always wanted to rest. Now I'm starting to think, was Tingyun, like, was every time she wanted to rest just a way to get away from us and start plotting something with people? Food for thought. <laughs> oh no. Hey, don't actually die on- hey. King? Oh, I think he's- I hope he's just passing out from exhaustion. A few moments later, Fuxuan and, Fuxuan and the Cloud Knights arrived. Star Skiff was ready to take you all to... I don't know where, but probably somewhere safe. If there's A dragon gallant, it's ocean distant. Interlude! Stay tuned to find out what happens next in the upcoming installment! Shadow of Preservation, some music, the arbor snaps... Well, we're home! Anonymous. Who's anonymously texting me? Sincerely, yours Kafka?! What? <laughs> what? I don't believe you're, you're Kafka. Why are you still here? I can't leave, need your help. <laughs> Bladies Mars Sims are getting serious, I can't leave. I, you know, this does sound like Kafka. The bounty on his head has not been cancelled yet, he's still top one criminal. Don't contact me again! <laughs> I won't be going. I've, there's no point in sending her away. It's all part of the script, guys. Where you at? You'll be here. Okay. <laughs> That's hilarious. Letter from a strange woman. Sampokoski! New scam? Let's go Sampokoski. I got him yesterday, so he's my daily. No one asked, I know. You can skip this, by the way. If you don't care about it, you can just press this. Oh, it's gone. I wanted to read it. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway. Wow, guys. That was, um... That was quite a bit of lore, huh? Mm, surprised? Not that much Kafka involve involvement in this one. But... So many other things. Wild. Uh, very excited for this game to continue. And mostly, I'm gonna take this game differently than how I'm taking Genshin in the sense that I think I will be watching like drip marketing and we'll be looking at the trailers and whatever. So all of that will happen probably on this channel or on stream. So if you're interested in that, <laughs> my favorite idol. I love that one. <laughs> then uh, there you go. All right. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And as I said, there's a couple questions I had. Please enlighten me if I'm right or wrong on those. Uh, I know you guys understand it way better than me. I try and understand it always, but it's especially when I record a long video like this, I can't really sit there and think about something for 15 minutes uh, because maybe I forget to cut it away. It'd be awful. But also because I want to like, you know, keep it going. And as I say, I make jokes and think about different things at the same time. So I can't really fully focus my mind on understanding the lore. So sometimes I'm a bit lacking like today, but I think I got the gist of it still. Anyway, very excited for the future. And uh, yeah, I really hope Kafka shows up when I build her a bit more and she gets more abilities because this Don Hong variant seems a hundred thousand times more broken than Kafka. Okay. Thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you in the next one. Lots of love. Bye-bye.